Are you going to wear those sunglasses the whole time? You know what? I don't even realize when they're on or, or, or off anymore. What does that mean? Because you know why? Because my, my life is that cool. Okay. So when I have sunglasses on indoors, I don't realize it. Okay. So I want to ask you something. Yo. Don't do that. Go ahead. Shoot, partner. You, you are. Welcome to, welcome to Fighter and the Kid. Yes, I know. Chris Lee is guesting. Now well, listen. is it? Get, well, looks like listen, it's two hosts First of all, me. your shoes make you. Those are lifts, obviously. They're, they're not on lifts. the outside of the Dude, shoe. I'm 6'2". Well, but those shoes make you 6'7". No, they're not. They're Air Maxes, dude. You're acting like they're fucking... Well, and they're gold, right? They're gold, yeah. Well, they're mat- They're like, you know, And then matted. the sh- socks don't go... I, I don't care because I'm not into fashion, but... Mm, uh, that's obvious. Slam. <laughs> no, Start out with slam. a fucking grand slam, it's dude. It's not a slam. Hey, was- man, we got a bunch of fucking specials here at Denny's, but you just wanted the good old-fashioned grand slam. No, that's not... Not, don't, that wasn't a slam, and your mouth is twisted in such a disrespectful manner. Be respectful. Okay, I'm respectful, dude. Right. You know what? I actually am respectful, and I'll tell you why. What? And I'm going to take off my sunglasses, Thank because you. I'm going to be respectful here, and I'm not a piece of shit. And well, what does a non-piece of shit do? Comes, comes bearing gifts. I got you... From a gift from Starbucks, That's dude. That's not. I can't. And I know you like this stuff. Nope, I can't eat that. You know it has why? Dairy and I have psoriasis. Because it's sweet, sweet. That's the it's worst. a simply strawberry. I can't eat that from Starbucks, and I got it for you. Now I drink a black fucking iced americano. Now that's as hard as it gets, dude. And I got that for you because you're a sweet tart. Tartan ass, that's why, man. I got you that pink fucking Simply Strawberry. It cost about four fifty, and that didn't make a fucking dent. <laughs> but I got it for you because you're a sweet don't, tart don't, tartan ass, dude. You fucking I can't I don't drink it all. No, I won't. Number one, I have psoriasis, and that will aggravate my skin. Number two, number two. I don't wouldn't eat this anyway because I'm a hard dude myself. You're not a hard dude. You look cute as shit don't with d- that. Don't take a yeah, oh that's a You have a pink iPhone case. I do. Because I wanted to match because I knew I was coming to see you. I change it with every day. I got a pink iPhone case for this because I, I knew I was coming here. It matches your pussy. No, no, no. Because <laughs> well, I knew I was coming here and I wanted to match your sweet tart tart ass, don't, dude. Don't say it like that. I don't want this. This isn't That's the fighter in the kid anymore. This is the the fucking the the real the the super deluxo kid. No, and no. the fucking sweet tart tart ass. Dude. No, no. Hey, welcome to the super deluxo kid and the sweet tart tart no, ass that's show. That's not the name. You're not going to rebrand this show that I've worked so well, hard that, to build. Well, all right? What the fuck is? Where's the other guy? Who cares where the other guy is? That's right. We're taking a break from the other guy. Now let me ask you this: You are. We all know that you are. You. Only live in Chrisville. Okay, and that's okay. And I won't deny that. Because you can only see as far as Chrisville. Now, is there anything in the news that is upsetting you? You feel like you need to contribute to? Yeah, of course, dude. Give me, give me it. What is it? I'm fucking. I, I, I'm firing on all on all cylinders, well, dude. What is it? Give and me. I know all about the news and what's going so on in the me world. An, give okay. Me a specific. Well, I don't. You know, I don't like what's going on in the world. Fucking generally, I don't okay, like what's that's, going on. See, again, you're I being also very don't like general. What's going on in the world sp- specifically? <laughs> is it, okay, can you yeah. get okay? So, what specifically do you not like going on? Well, I don't mean to put you on a spot, but I just feel yeah. like. Because I, I feel like you are a little bit. But. No, I'm, I'm trying to I'm trying to expand your horizons, and I feel like right now you're only reaching as far as Chrisville, and right, I want to know if there's any way it's not like that that dude. we can look beyond that. So, what about the news is bothering you? Well, there, it's a very politically charged atmosphere, and that's and you're being general, man. No, but we have to figure out what the fuck to do <laughs> on all fronts because if we don't, yeah. then. I don't know where this. I honestly don't know where this country's headed. I see. You're being, I see history repeating itself. Ah, oh, you're saying a lot of stuff. I, I, I see. If we're not careful, I see. I see us getting into a lot of hot water, and we're already in hot water. What we got to do is we got to get out of that hot, hot water and get our head above the water. Okay, right? man, you're sounding a lot like Trump when he was he was running wrong. for office. You're being wrong. That's what he did. What. He goes wrong. You didn't even let me finish. Okay, well, you were wrong, though. Well, but, I didn't mean to do what he did, but you were well, wrong. Well, specifically. We, could all, we all know that you were wrong. All of us no, know that no, you were wrong. No, man. You're bullying your everyone's way out of saying, this conversation. Everyone's saying that you're wrong. Nobody's saying. You don't know. Everyone says. You're bullying your way out of this conversation. So you, with the tiny <sighs> ankles, 
I've where got tiny ankles. Well, you have. We're, we're. I think what happened in the womb. No, it's all right, dude. But that area didn't grow, right? So, right. so what? Don't say. Well, you know right what happened? It afterwards. did grow. It doesn't matter. Who cares? And we're gonna move on from this. It's interesting. You have big feet. Now, from your ankles to your hips. Yeah. It seems to me. Well, I don't care. No, don't no, say. I don't care. Okay. You don't care, but what? It dude? seems to me that after the age of fourteen. That area took a break. Okay. It didn't it's, come back. Okay. But everything else grew. No, that's not true, so, And dude. so who cares that you have 14-year-old legs? But you'd agree with that. But don't least. say that. I work out my legs all the time. I, I do it all the time. It's yeah. very hard. But I'm, you know what I mean? I'm yeah. trying, and there's only up from here. Which is why sport's not for you, because sport comes from the legs at the end of the day. Right? Yeah, sport's I know that. But you. sports, dude, I, but okay. you can be a gamer. Oh, uh, so sports are for you, dude? Sports what? are for you? What? <laughs> I'm an athlete. All right, dude, don't say that, man. No, no, You're not a fucking athlete no, but just because you an, picked up I'm boxing an, at 47. I'm an, I'm an athlete. Oh, really? I've never taken a break from my sport. Dude. My sports. All right. All right. No, it's I'm not always plural. a little what, sore. Chess is, uh, you mean chess. When That's you, technically a when sport. When you take in, me in. What? When you take me in. Uh, bro, I don't take you in, no. man. Visually, you take me in periodically. No. And you, and you, and, and I've seen this happen and I don't, I don't blame you, but there's a, there's a, a primordial thing that happens when an, a real alpha walks in the room and you do this, and I've seen you do it, and I don't care, but you go. You just, Hold on, you go. Right. Dude, yeah, I don't breathe bit. like There's that, man. That. Well, no, I don't. Initially, when I'm standing in my no, cubic space and no. I'm feeling the impression that God has given me in the world. I and do I, what? And I, and I feel it well. You go. Dude, I don't bit. breathe like that when I fucking, first of all, I don't take you in. Well, it's involuntary, but when, because what I do is I'm It's saying, not involuntary. So that doesn't happen. I've heard you do this. You're t- saying when you walk in. Yeah. And you go. <laughs> That's so, bullshit. Because what you're seeing is, is the hard, true, and very full, well, truth, right? No, I mean, no, 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 isn't no. That, isn't you're that, saying when, when, when you walk in, I go like this? <laughs> yeah. And no, dude, you, that's and bullshit. And I heard you say this. He's the answer. No, that's stupid. Okay. He's the answer. That's what I've heard. The I, fuck out of here. All right, maybe it's a, maybe I misheard. Get out of here, dude. I'm sorry. I'm nasally, guys. <laughs> you guys, I'm I'm really nasally. Why? Because I got stuffed up. Because, dude, I I've been fucking nasally. I went to the doctor the other day, and I go like this. What is it? And he's like, dude, sometimes you're just fucking too sick with it. <laughs> that's not what the doctor said. I was like, I'm sorry, and he was like, yeah. He looked at me up from his glasses, and he goes like this. There's really nothing I can prescribe you. I said, but you're the doctor. And he said, I know, but there's nothing we can do. You're just too sick with it. <laughs> he said, you're too sick with it. And I'm like, that's why I'm nasally. And he says, that's my best guess. So he, he you're says. too sick with it. So right. W-I-D-D. T, yeah. Or D. I don't, know, I don't even know, but he just goes, with you're it. sick with it, man. You are sick with it. And then I go out and I go to pay. And I was like, what do I owe? And they were like, uh, you know what? We don't want to charge you. We love your work. But you're just. Oh, come on. No, I know. I know. I know. That's why I said, oh, come on, please. Come right. On. I know. I was in your shoes right here. I was like, please, let me pay something, you know, at least two, three grand. I don't know how much it costs. <laughs> but they were like, whatever doesn't make a. Uh, uh, and. Oh but and then. And you're then so self congratulatory, like, man. But she was like. She was like, yeah, you're sick with it. And I was like, oh, it's all good. She's like, I knew somebody who was sick with it once. I was like, who? And she said, Gregory Peck. I was like, Jesus, that was a long time ago. But apparently, <laughs> you know, he was very famous. You yeah, know he was. Peck, right? Of course He I was know. like more your time, period. But um, that's... It was like the Grapes of Wrath, which was big right around when Brian was 40. All right, bro. Um, but, but, my, congratulatory is very funny you say I'm congratulatory because my podcast, Congratulations, is just skyrocketing in the uh, charts, man. I, you've been talking about yourself the whole time. No, no, you no, need you, to start talking about other mm, things besides yourself. I'm not. People, you know what's funny? I'm not talking about myself, but I think, I, I swear to God, there was a second a few months ago, I started thinking of, I, I started thinking that my name was. What the fuck? It's him. <laughs> You're insufferable. No, no. This is other people. I know it what the fuck is going me. on, dude. I've been around you. Yeah, you get recognized, okay? But don't act like you're not Justin Bieber. No, no, no. I, I, that's what I say to them. I'm like, no, guys, no. it's not Justin Bieber. And they go like, what the fuck? It's him. I thought my name for a, no, for a second, I swear to God, I thought no. my name was, what the fuck? There he is. No, no. And I was no. like, "What? Is, my name's Chris. Yeah. And they're like, yeah, we know. Yeah. And you know, I've seen a lot of pictures of you sometimes that on the internet when you're young, mm. when you didn't have a beard mm. and when you had short hair mm-hmm. and it was interesting because like 
that's the guy with the lunch pail, right? What? Well. Wait, what? Well, some people go through a transition, and what they do is they go, there's the guy you shove in the corner. Okay. Give me your lunch. Whatever it is, <laughs> right? Or or uh, let's just shove him around. Or, or you know what? That's what they do, right? Uh, yeah, no. Then, 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 then go, they don't you get, do that Then you me. get mad in the mirror and you go, I'm going to make a change. Like, <laughs> no, right? no, 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 I'm gonna no. I'm going to make no, a change. No. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, I know. That's true. And then you go, and you have your dad's like, let's get him a stylist. And you're like, a stylist? Yeah, it's like, I don't care how much it costs. I don't care. I no, money. no, dude, I don't have and a then, stylist. And then you, you, your dad pays a stylist a thousand, ten thousand, whatever. And then he got, the stylist goes, grow your hair long, grow a scruff, and then reinvent yourself because your, your name used to be Dennis. Now it's Chris. Is that true? No, that's not true. My name was never Dennis. Okay, dude. it could have been back then, right? Would've All right, no, it, wa- it was not. It couldn't have been. My name was Chris and only Chris. Wouldn't have made a dick. If. It would have made a diff. And also, people fucking, if anything, my name is what the fuck it's him. No. That's what I'm saying. Now, Chris, when you're at your house, me what the you fuck post videos him. sometimes of your, you and your your home. Uh, your dad can barely, barely take you and your brother. You I guys know. have the most ridiculous conversations. That's true. We do. We have ridiculous conversations. But you know what? Yeah. He made us, so it's his fault. I know. It's you, all- you guys are close, though. Yeah, we were very close. How's mom? Good. How's dad? Good. How's your brother who looks up to me? No, I, that's not actually. He's skinny. I could beat his ass. Okay, dude. But, I could. but why are you saying that? But when that? I see him, I go, I'll punch you in the chest once, you'd quit. But why well, would you say that to him? But why would you say that? I just want him to know that I'm, I can kick his ass. All right, dude. Yeah, I, like, I can kick his ass. And by the way, if he's walking around with his girl, I'll take her if I want. Bro, okay. You don't need <laughs> to say that. I wouldn't. I, I will. I'll go All like right. this. I'll go up to him and I go, hey. Scram. All right, that's some 1960s uh, bullshit. I and I don't want you to say hey. scram. You say scram to my brother one time? <laughs> no, no, no. That's disrespectful, dude. Scram. Don't. And then and then you you go Nah, bro. Yeah, yeah, and you go, Brian, don't. And you try you you try to peacock up and I Nah, go, bro. I go, "What?" No. What? I'm you, too lanky you, for you to deal with, bro. I'm you, too lanky for you to deal with. You want you want to step? Huh? You want to step? That bro, at me? that's absolutely not how it will go yeah. down. You want these fucking spaghetti arms wrapped around your fucking <laughs> neck, dude? You in the mood for some dying, huh? You in the mood for some fucking dying food? Is, is that what you say when you find? Yep, I go like that. I look at people dead, fucking square in the eye, and I say, "Hey, dude, are you hungry? Cause I got some dying food for you, for you." And then I fucking whip around. They don't even know. They're like, "Where'd you go?" And I'm behind them, just. Strangling the shit out of them. Really? You ever strangle? I don't even choke. I strangle. Okay, take it easy. When was the last time you fought, you were in a fight? Oh God, dude! So many times. It's Have you and your brother ever come to to fisticuffs? Only one time. Really? Yeah. How old were you? Young. I what? punched him. You did? Yeah, because he was choking me, or he punched me, or something. I don't remember. He's your I... younger brother too. Yeah. And you you beat him up. He huh? was punching me or something, and then I. Let him have it, but I was bigger and older. So. Over what, like dad, mother? No, dude, what? don't be. It was know. probably about some cool shit like money or chicks. <laughs> yeah, why aren't you drinking your fucking? Because I'm not. Strawberry? I'm not a tart, tart and ass. You are a. T- uh, you're a fucking sweet tart, tart and ass. No, welcome I'm not. To f- welcome to the super deluxe kid and the sweet tart, no. tart and ass. Now, what's going on with you? Oh, dude. No. Hey, dude. Brian tries to take it down to Boringville, fucking. <laughs> What do you want to talk about, bro? We're here. This is it. Yeah. Fucking Brendan Schaub. He's not here, huh? No, he's not. Guy doesn't. He honestly doesn't. He, you know what? He doesn't have. He doesn't have the fucking determination. That's why he's that's not. That's how I feel. Yep. And I'll tell you something else. He's off in Austin or something. He's working on other business ventures. Yep, that's right. He's being Mister Entrepreneur. Yeah. I don't have that in me. I'm not a. You're a performer, guy. bro. I'm a performer. Yep. He's got all kinds of ventures. I know. He's going to be like very wealthy. Yeah. God bless him. And huh? I go like this. I go. Oh, cool. That's good. Then yeah. he goes, let's talk about Big Brown Coffee. I'm like, all right. <laughs> I'm not organized. <laughs> I'm the worst. I'm surprised you showed up here before I did, to be honest. No, I've been on time lately. Yeah. <laughs> no. no. <laughs> if you had a sound effect for who you are and what your life is, what would it be? Don't be a dick. Okay, I won't. Be honest. Okay, like, I, w- so I won't. Chris Lee's life, give me a sound effect. Don't be. Okay, I won't. Don't I won't, be. I won't, I, won't, I won't. Just be honest. I won't. <clears throat> you want to hear it? Is it. No, it's not that, dude. All right, I don't know. You know what it is? It's this. Oh. 
And that's obvious. So that's a rocket taking off? <laughs> yep. And then turning into fucking sparkly flames. <laughs> yep. Really? Yeah. And I'm right. I'm, I'm, if you can believe it or not, I'm still at the launching sequence. Really? Right now. Because I've, what, so mm, I was trying to think of, for me, I guess. I guess yours <clears> would be, <throat> ooh, right? No. But, but, but right? But yours would be, ooh, right? No. <laughs> No, I, I, not to be a dick. I think mine because I'm older and I've kind of gotten to where it's like I, I'm, it's like oh, in a way because I've I've arrived. <laughs> well, no, I've I've broken through that. So so you're still trying to find it, and in a way, when you reach that, you go, I've been here this whole time. You know that it comes full circle. Yeah, it does. Well, I don't fucking believe a word you say, but that's how about that? How, about how often that? do you YouTube my stand up? To inspire yourself. Is your, do you have clips on YouTube? <laughs> Besides this bullshit show, do you have? No, don't but do you have clips? Yeah, of your stand I do. Up on yeah. YouTube. Yeah, I do. You know that Kevin Hart after I did Ride Along called me up and he goes, uh, "Hey man, I'm just calling. I'm, I'm wondering why? Why do you only have like like 170 view, thousand views?" <laughs> he was talking about his. You don't know him. I do, huh? I know Kevin Hart, really? dude. We did the fucking Justin Bieber roast, and I saw him a few months ago mm -hmm. at the comedy store, and he brought me up on stage. Well, after he bumped me. <laughs> yeah, he'll bump you. No, but not for long. Hey, you're doing Carnegie Hall. Yeah. I'm. I'm you little jail? Yeah. I mean, it'd yeah. be a big deal for God. Carnegie Hall. Yeah, I know. Actually, it's pretty crazy. I didn't realize how crazy. You know, you book these dates, and like, you're not sure about like. You don't think about it. You just book a bunch of dates. And then like when I promoted the Carnegie Hall one, when I put it on my Instagram, I got so many texts. I was like, what? You're playing Carnegie Hall? And I was like, fuck, I guess that is cool. It is a big deal. You don't deal. even think about it, though, when it's you, you know? Yeah, but Carnegie Halls are almost like all bullshit aside. It's almost like the pinnacle. I mean, you can play stadiums. Well, I don't know what that places. means. Yeah, sure. But I don't think I, I think Carnegie Hall is like literally, literally that there's a joke or there's a saying, how do you get to Carnegie Hall? Practice. Right, 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 right. Yeah, true. I think <laughs> I mean, it's look maybe... at that. Look at that. Are you going to fill that? Yeah. That's where the the biggest performance in the world. That performed. is fucking beautiful. Huh? Look at that. Oh, that's, that's crazy. That's you don't know anything about history, but that was built not last year. You know that that was built a while ago. Yeah, two thousand seven or something. No, no, <laughs> no. Find out when Carnegie Hall was built. It's an um, unbelievable. That it's literally like I, I think a that's, huge milestone. I would say that's probably the most famous theater, right? One hundred percent. Yeah, I think so. Yeah. I mean, that's you don't get bigger than that. What, yeah. Do you do you find yourself 43. like saying I think I'm just gonna um, I'd like do you ever feel like 1941 43 43 do you ever feel like you just want to um, do stand up sometimes and not do anything else I mean look it's like well how many specials have you done two or three I'm, this is my third okay so and did you do it yet no I'm doing it oh in Chicago July right July 20, 20th yeah oh fuck I want to go actually yeah you should July 20th yeah I wonder if I can um uh. It's just the thing that you're in control of. Like, I mean, it. you know, I guess you want to keep, like, growing or whatever that means and talking about other things in your yeah. life. And, you know, you live life and then document it by doing a special. Right. Uh, doing exactly. That's exactly right. But it's, a, it's like a diary. Yeah, I suppose. But, yeah. like, so, but it's also the only thing you're in control of. Like, in Hollywood, like, you get gigs and, and you, and you, and you do them. But as an actor, you have no control over it. None. Unless you're creating your own show, but then even, even then, still, it's such a collaborative thing. Yeah, right? you, yeah, it's a collaborative thing, which which is fun in yeah, its own way. Yeah, yeah it but is. it's it's not the. But boil. you're you're going to find that your expression is watered down in right. one way or another. Well, plus even 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 besides the fact that it's a collaborative effort, then you get the network involved. Yeah, and they have their own thing that they want to do, yeah. and they give you notes, and it's just it, it's I I like doing that as well, but for a different reason. But stand up just seems like the thing that you're always in control of it's and pure. can do it. Yeah, you can do it whenever you, you, you know, I mean, I'm doing this tour now and it's like, it's my livelihood and I don't have to say yes to shows I don't want to do. And also I feel like it's the last place where you can actually still speak your mind. Yeah. And that's, that, that's yeah. amazing. And even that's fucking tough now. But yeah, I mean, it I is. still do it and, and we do, still do, you do see it. Any, do you get any backlash? Nah, I don't. I mean, I mean, online sometimes like, oh, you shouldn't have talked about this. You shouldn't have talked about that. But it's like, I, I, you, I don't care about that. You no. know, it's like that. Uh, I mean, people were getting at fucking Chappelle on his last special about saying things that it's like, if they're, you're they're, at, they're just so, it, they're, they're so just, dumb. Yeah. It's the liberals though. You know, it's yeah. the hard liberals that are the just like, left. you can't say this, you can't say that. Um, but I don't, I, you know, I get why comedians don't want to do colleges, but I'll, I'll, I'll do them as long did as Did I tell you I did a no corporate gig 
with these lawyers and the woman came up. Oh, yeah. And she goes. Um, Did you talk about this on the show yet? I, a little bit, but this woman yeah. came up. She was a, this big time lawyer and she goes, you were really offensive. And I had to be up there for, I had to give awards. I don't know why I did yeah. this. I, I'm probably not going to do corporate gigs ever again. I mean, it's good money. It's crazy money, but I, but I just don't find them comfortable because I, I think because I think because I'm dude. lying because I think I feel like a liar. It, I, well, I, I think mean, I feel like I'm doing it only for the dollar yeah, bill. Yeah, and I and I'm and I'm in some weird auditorium, and it's not built for stand up, and they're all yeah. looking up, and they're all at dinner tables. Eating. I don't. I'm not. I don't want to do that. Clanking. I don't want to do it. Yeah, you don't want to do it. But who are you kidding? You say yes for a dollar, but yeah, no, but, no, no, yeah, yeah, but anyway, no. But yeah. Well, that's the problem is they pay you a lot, but a I don't lot, think I yeah. want. If I wanted to make money that way, I would work for a corporation. Yeah, I see. And, and and there's nothing wrong with that. But the woman goes, <clears throat> "You were really offensive." I go, "Really? What part?" She goes, "The whole thing." And her friend goes, "You have a long way to go." To and you? I, yep. And I went, "Thank you very much." On and stage into yeah. the microphone. Yeah, she stuff said this? that kills usually. But I, but again, I was like, they were lawyers, they were all partners, and it was a weird environment. And, I, and they, I, you, you just come in, and start doing stand up, and they were like, this is uncomfortable because he's not being very politically correct or safe. You have a long way to go. Yeah, it was incredible. That's I what actually she said. couldn't believe it. And and she said this in front of everybody. And everyone oh yeah, heard? she said in front of her whole her whole uh, like her. The, the, I think it was seven of them came up to you know what. Award. What a hero she is. Uh, well, that's the thing. Do you know what I mean? And I said, I, after, after, after an hour, I came back up on stage and I said, I kind of addressed what she had said and then in front of everybody. And I kind of like said, if you, if you think that I'm, you know, essentially don't know why that's offensive. Yeah. And I was just doing, I was setting you up. Right. Or the joke, uh, right, 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 and it right. wasn't offensive anyway. I go, oh, and, of course. I mean, yeah. Imagine they, if you they watch actually, they actually, they actually came back around. Yeah, because I was like, do you do, like what are you doing? And also, it was just weird. It, we, they, she was part of this professionally offended. You, you should have just said world. thank you for your money. Yeah, I did. Yeah, I did. I said thank you. I said I got scolded, and I pointed over there. It bothered me. It really made it, me. It, it, it made me angry, and I don't get angry. It made me angry yeah, you and don't embarrassed. Get angry, actually, but you know what it is, though. It's like it's not even the fact that it offends you. It because it's not that. It's the audacity somebody has to to just say that. I know. It's like it's not. It's not like because you know you're funny, dude, and yeah. you know that person is just a, a boring piece of shit. To be yeah. honest. Um, and although, although th there is this, like when I got up on stage in Canada for Just for Laughs, and uh, Vern Cox, who's a transgender actress on mm -hmm. um, Orange is the New Black, mm -hmm. she was hosting it. So the crowd was pretty, and, and it was liberal. Canada, very liberal. When I got up on stage, at, at first it was interesting because there was, a, I felt it was a very, very politically correct crowd. Anyway, I got him. I yeah, got him yeah, and, yeah. I, and I did well. Right. But a lot of people came up to me after me like that was so amazing. We thought you were going to be this frat boy, and then you totally fooled though, us. But that's, but, but that's what happens. So they have an image of you because yep. you got a forward tilt. You're a dude, yep. and they're expecting you to talk about chicks. And, yeah. But I'm not. <clears throat> and it was it was an interesting. I feel thing. it too, dude. Yeah. When you do rooms that are like the off rooms or like the fucking, you know, alt comedy rooms. Oh yeah. You do those, and it's like first of all, there are and 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 dude, please, like there are some hilarious alt comics. Oh, yeah. Like, absolutely hilarious. Um, but sometimes I go in those rooms, man, and and I swear to God, most of them, most of the people there are laughing because they're like, yeah. Well, it's you're drowning in irony. They're right, drowning right, in right. irony. It's so not funny that it's funny. It's like when you watch, have you ever gone to an, uh, me and Dub Davidoff went to a fucking modern art, these modern art uh, galleries in Chelsea, in New York. Oh, my God. Yeah. They had a they had a sign. It yeah. said jungle, jungle, jungle. It was a neon sign. Yeah. It was three hundred and fifty thousand dollars. Yeah, I know. Then there's string hanging from a ceiling. Just string. Yeah. That would cost you a hundred thousand dollars. Yeah. Because it's made by I've a certain shit. I know. a certain it's weird. asshole who calls himself an artist. It's weird. There's a boulder in the middle of uh, yeah. a boulder is three hundred thousand dollars. Yeah, the colored rock shit. You, you see the fuck, rock the rock fuck you. the rock on the car dented and yeah. shit. That yeah. even that takes effort. But sure, yeah, no, I know there's shit that there's no effort. Pull yet. up pull up modern art infuriating. It's ridiculous. I mean, dude, some of it is so annoying. Infuriating. Um yeah, I I Some of it's awesome. I mean, some of it's great. Yeah. Like 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 this shit is no, that's you know, good. the painting. That, that's Van Gogh right there. Yeah, you don't even great. know who that is. But uh no, yeah, I do. Not dude. really. No, but bring up a stupid modern art or something <laughs> like that. It's so annoying. Stupid but expensive modern art. Yeah, there you go. 
Yeah, those are go go to that go to the first one. Those are that's just a white canvas. Oh, cool. That's terrible. <laughs> that's a white canvas. And it's like they're like, oh, but we're saying, you know, no, you, you're part of a club. Yeah, but it's like, oh, but our, our art is. Not, it's like, dude, don't don't make a statement that hard. Don't try that hard to make a goddamn yeah, statement. You're, you're about, part of a group that 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 that, that costs hundreds of thousands of dollars. Yep, yep, yep. For Look at that, forty three million dollars for that blue bullshit. <laughs> forty three million dollars. Imagine, because the guy died. There's a right. there's a line through it, but he was the first to do it. No, that's two separate pieces, dude. We went to a art no thing, and it. this woman was looking at it. And I go, it was it was it was logs, yeah. and then it was um this this weird like plastic thing on the ground. I go, what is that? She goes, well, whoever thought of taking the sculptor and off the 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 mount and showcasing the mount? I was like. And Dove David go, Dove goes, well, I could tell a joke that falls flat over and over again. And just because I put it in a large room with a skylight doesn't mean it's good. Uh, Look at that. There you go. 50,000. That? That. <laughs> this is a messy bedroom. That's $50,000? 150000 Wow. I'd beat the shit out of, how about I beat the shit out of the guy who made that <laughs> and anybody who buys it and then we put them on the bed. Yeah. We soak the bed with their blood. Oh, there's that guy who does those fucking the balloon animal thing right there. What's that guy's name? He's like he, be, he's like the guy. Whoever did that, I think. At least that's kind of like. Well, yeah, that would yeah, work. It takes, in your t- house. it takes something. Yeah, I mean, to at make least. that, but but still, this guy. No, but the shit that it's like millions and millions and millions of dollars. This piece. Well, yeah, that, but to see, he's he's <laughs> smart because he's a con man. Yeah, he's a con and man. Yeah. People who buy it are morons. They're, they're the same, what are yeah. these people? Are they demonstrating against it? Uh, no, those probably are fans, but the, the, I forget what the guy's oh, name is, but he was street. really big in the fucking, uh, uh, a few, a few years ago. And I don't know if he's still super big, but I mean, the guy sells shit for like $40 million. Oh, crazy. Yeah. Insane. Oh, David Cho's good though. He's a different kind of guy. He did the art for, he's the guy who did the art for Facebook before it was Facebook and got shares in the company. The art for Facebook? Yeah, on their, he did their mural on their like building or their oh. wall yeah. in the office. Oh, wow. They okay. offered wow. him um, 30000 for it, or do you want stock? No. And he took stock? Yeah, he took stock. Good job, Smart David dude. Joe. Wow. If you had, I think if I had that much money, though, I don't know. Well, I'd definitely do stand-up still, but I think I'd be, yeah. I'd have you killed. What? I would. Well, I'd have you banned for how, no reason. How, and then I'd re- Jeff Coons, that's yeah. what it is. Jeff Coons. Yeah, Coons. Oh, that, well, Coons is famous. As oh, shit. shut up! You didn't know who you fucking. <laughs> no, I know was. David I Coons is Jeff Coons. Is. <laughs> David Coons. No, Jeff Coons is a famous pop artist. He's called a pop artist. Um, but that's uh, just so weird, huh? How weird is art? I it's know. like I get the abstractness of it, and like how it can be beautiful. But it's like once you start veering away. From and art shouldn't just be what's realistic, right? But like, obviously, it's easy to tell something is super good if it's painted super realistically because you're like, oh, okay, wow, you imitated how yeah, fucking yeah, real yeah. life is. But then when you start getting <clears throat> off into the like, you know, well, Jackson the, Pollock, on the other is, end is Jackson Pollock, yeah, and it's he, just like, okay, and there's rhythms and shit, and yeah, you know, art to it, and, all, yeah. and uh, is your dad and uh, brother into art? No. Not, not not painting and shit, yeah. not sculpture. No. It's a whole different thing. That guy, that uh, Jackson Pollock was was a legit. There's a there's a method to that madness. I don't know what it is, but there. I don't know what it is either. But I mean, or maybe not. You know. Yeah. But see, there's you know at least yeah, at least stuff it's something. You know, it's like yeah, there's stuff in there. And then and his wife started doing started painting. She's good too. Is she? His wife's very good. Yeah. Guy doesn't fucking know a dick. You know a dick. Do you have any art on your walls? No, I paint. I'm a painter. What do you paint, dude? Uh, Be I have, careful. Honestly. Uh, Bring up one painting right now on the fa- internet. Phallic pieces. <laughs> you too? Yep. Cocks. Oh, God. But yep, I paint cocks. I love painting cocks. Why? Really little, little cocks all over oh, the wall. Oh, God. It has nothing to do, not big ones at all. You don't paint actual cocks? You don't paint on no, cocks? No, no, no. I would never paint an actual Have cock. you ever had a cock, another person's cock in your hand? No, dude. Never in your life? No, never in you my never life. You never had a cock, a hard cock in your hand? No. Have you? No. <laughs> oh, God. You have? Um, it's okay. What color was it? <laughs> um, it was dark as night. But I remember um, <laughs> my friend in college said, um, I don't know, you ever see a cock, like a hard cock, and you just want to grab it? No. I swear to God. And I was like, you're gay. <laughs> yeah. And what no, did he I say? haven't. And what did he say? And then my acting teacher one time was like, you guys, you straight guys, even you straight guys, you know, in college when you suck each other off, oh, you know. And I go, and nobody said anything. I go. I don't do that. 
<laughs> I never did that. I never had an urge to do that. He goes, and he goes, yeah, sure, right. And he cut, moved on with the conversation. I looked at my friend. Really? I, like, I fucking, do you do that? My buddy's like, I don't do that shit. I don't know. I got a buddy, uh, comedian, uh, gay comedian, Thomas Dale. You know Thomas? No. He's always like, yeah, everybody, everybody. You can get anybody. You can get any straight guy to fuck. No. Or suck. No, but, you uh, can't. I'm like, I don't think so, man. I don't man. think so, dude. I, and he's like. Unless you look like a gal. Yeah. Dude, oh, yeah, he's a good guy. Oh, he's so, that guy is so funny, man. He is, right? Yes. Yeah. He is so funny. Yeah. Look. For, yeah, he's very funny. Thomas Dale. Love that guy. Um. Yeah, no. I mean, he's a good looking guy. Yeah. Tom Cruise, when I met him, I've met a lot of stars, stars. Okay, man. And I was talking to him for an hour and a half, and I wanted to be his friend because I was so starstruck. Of course. Because I had done a reading with him before that, and he was like, you're the best. And I remember, no. uh, <clears throat> well, he's really nice to me. And I remember thinking to myself, like, if I was, if he wanted to make out with me, it would be, I, I'm so starstruck that I'd, I'd have to, like, <laughs> I'd be like, oh, I have a stomach ache and I have to run away. Like, yeah, yeah, I wouldn't yeah, be yeah. able to. Be like, like I'd be, if I was even like, a little no, bit, bro. if I was one percent more gay, I would do it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I like that's you. how badly I wanted to be his yeah, friend. Yeah, yeah. But that's not being gay. That's just you being like a fucking starstruck guy. Star fucker. Star. You're you're a you're a star. Everybody's fucker. a star fucker. If, depending on the star. Who have you met? That I suppose so. Yeah. What what famous person have you met that like holy shit? Um, the guys that I have met that where I was like wow were Keanu Reeves. You know I love oh, Keanu yeah. Reeves. Uh, and uh, probably Vince Vaughn. Oh yeah, I fucking I'm a huge. Fan. I think he's Vince a great guy. So funny. Yeah, um, I, like, I like him. I want to get and, him on the podcast. Oh well, when I was a kid, Jim Carrey. Yeah, I was I was fourteen. You met him? Yeah, I, I remember. I didn't wash my hand for a few days. No. Yep. How funny is that? No way. Yep. And then when I went That's to so cool. Mo- I went to Montreal last year, and and Jim was on my flight for the I'm dying up here thing that he was promoting, and I but I didn't know. And then uh, I hear, hey, Chris. And I look up and no. it's Jim Carrey. Yeah. No. And I was like, oh, hey, what's up? Like, I mean, apparently he knew I was because I'm a comedian, I guess. But like, I was like, oh, hey, man, how's it going? And he's like, how are you? And I was like, I'm good. And he, and he was like, no, really, though. How are you? And I was like, <laughs> well, I'll let you know by the end of the flight, I guess. And he was like, ha well, good seeing you. And I was like, oh, okay, cool. And I was like, Jesus Christ, did I just have a fucking conversation with Jim Carrey? And he cool. knows who I am? Do you know that's, what I mean? That's amazing. And, uh, and That's then, uh, and then we Did landed. He have a beard? And then, yeah, he had a, uh, no. I think he had just shaved. It was like right, and then, um, and then, yeah, he just he had just shaved because he was promoting the show. And then we got off the plane, and when we got off the plane, we, we were walking through customs and shit, talking to each other. We're talking about Trump, actually. <laughs> he he um. Well, he does art now. Yeah, he's a, he's. I think he's a bit manic, or he's bipolar, or he. He, I think he just deals with depression, or, or maybe he just got so famous he was like, "Oh, whatever." But talk about he's so good. Though. But talk about like he's so talented, dude. Oh yeah. I mean, like his art is. I mean, good. It's really good. Yeah, man. He's and and he's he's no joke, man. Jim I know. Carrey's it, it's crazy no how fucking joke. He's a real artist, I guess, lack of a better word. Yeah. The only thing is that that sometimes people like that get away from what they are so good at. Sure, and and and, and oh, then they cool. feel like what they do because in a way they've mastered it. Or yeah, in a yeah, way yeah. Kinda, well, look at uh, yeah. Uh, uh, yeah, which is why a lot of guys don't do stand up anymore, like Steve uh, Steve Martin. Yeah, and I think ultimately that might be a mistake. It would be for me, only because only because I would I would have to fill the void. I'd have to turn on stand up in one way or another. Like I I already have a love hate relationship with success and mm. everything, so it would be bad for me. Look at that. That's good. Is that him? Or yeah. Did he paint that? Or is that just somebody painted him, though? I don't uh, know. Someone painted him. Yeah. This is yeah. artist Fabian Corinna. You know, he's okay. He's not a great artist, but he's okay. I mean, his stuff is... But it's its its, its own style. It's its its yeah. like you don't see shit like it. And it's good. It takes talent. I mean, like, I, I don't think I could do that. Yeah. I don't know. I don't know. I think he's good. I think I think he's one of those guys yeah. that just can figure out how to do the thing. Yeah. Like Rogan is that way. Joe yeah. Rogan. Like whatever Joe he picks does, something up, he'll do it. He obsesses. Yeah. He won't play golf because of that. I said stay away from golf because you'll go crazy. Yeah, 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 yeah. The way he is with archery, oh, like for he'll, sure. he'll lose oh, for his sure. fucking mind with, with golf. Those guys, people like that are, are a special kind of person. I you know. know what I mean? They obsess. 
Me, I, I'm not like that. I mean, I obsess, but about like two or three things. Yeah, me too. Not like fucking... stand up, I I'm, I'm uncompromising about. <laughs> right, right, right. But but everything else. And you wouldn't know that watching your act, but it's it's <laughs> but it's crazy, right? That's well, an underhanded. Yar, though. No, not not great. At yeah, at what at practicing stand up. Oh no, you're great at practice. No. My tennis and boxing is no joke. Uh, yeah, first of well, all. Well, my hands are heavy and fast. You know that. You know what it is, though? It comes from my legs. That's dude, something that you're not going to experience. But by the way, what? my legs are just as strong as yours. <laughs> no, if, that's not true. And my legs, if you look at like my ass and the way my ass, my it talks into my lower back what? and then my back goes boom out. I have a so good butt, dude. You don't have. I do have a good butt. <laughs> that's not true. It's you true. Got, you have a bad lower body. Who cares? Now, what? Don't what? do that. Dude, I can't believe I'm fucking still sick with it. You, you suffer from allergies. That's all it is, dude. No, that's what I thought. You yes. have a weakness. That's because you're L.A. born and raised. Uh, no, I'm not, born. I'm not on, L.A. born and raised, You dude. live on fucking I'm white fucking bread New Jersey, and mustard. Dude. I'm from fucking New Jersey. You understand me? What do you eat now? Hey, did you change? Did you change your diet a little bit? Obviously, look at my fucking physique, dude. No. <laughs> I'm, dude, I'm, you know what? I'm shredded. Dude. No, you're not. I'm fucking shredded. What are it's, you? It's ridiculous. No. Are you lifting? I'm doing a lot of core shit. I'm doing a lot of fucking, I'm doing a lot of, uh, what do you call it? You uh, got a trainer come over to your house? I used to. Now I took all the stuff. I fucking make it, my, I made it my own, dude. I do a lot of You don't go to training. the gym? Yeah, I do. What I gym? To, Crunch? Like I'm going to say, like I need to sign some fucking autographs. Is that my workout? Oh, come on, man. <laughs> damn it but, no but I do, I do i go to the gym and i fucking uh i do a lot of like circuit training and shit i do a lot of box jumps i do a lot of fucking kettlebells i fucking kill it i love it dude no i love it i love it no you not you're not like a workout oh guy. i'm not no oh i'm not no no oh yeah right dude on my membership it says what the fuck it's him that's my no. yeah no. that's my membership no part. that's not true that's not true man let me see what time it is okay cool that's a good thing to do on this podcast <laughs> Hey guys, welcome to the segment. Let's see what time it is. We've been doing this for forty-four minutes. So when you come, when you're on, uh, when you're on the show, when you're on our show, but no. Brendan is hosting it, yeah. right? Yeah. When you're doing our show, yeah. But Brendan is a guest host. Uh-huh. What do you guys talk about? What do you guys talk about if you don't have a fucking star-studded guest, which obviously is what has helped you guys. No. And with that being said. E you well. No, no. I never thanked you for that. I know, but you We should. talk about life. We talk about shit that doesn't have to do with us. No, you we talk expand about expand our horizons. No, you talk about fighting and then you bring up a boring ass book you're trying to no, read. No, we talk about yeah, we talk about reading and and sport. And oh, politics. Oh my god, and dude. Things that matter in the world. You not guys, about not about just Killing it. Let me tell you something. Crushing dude. and coming. You guys want to talk about something? You guys want to fucking uh, uh, get away from all this bullshit? You come on down to congratulations with Crystal. No, no. What did That's you? My podcast, what was your dude. morning? You woke up at what time? I actually woke up at eight thirty, dude. And and did what? I went and I had a meeting. When did? And then what did you at have for breakfast? And what did you have? Eggs. Just eggs. Eggs with some basil and tomatoes in it. Not bad. Killing it. Okay. And then, and coffee. And I had two iced Americanos. And then I got another and you get iced them Americano. Black, huh? Oh, yeah, dude. So you, you know, know why, dude? You go coffee all day. I go coffee all day. Shots, shots. You know that song? Shots, 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 shots. Yeah. That's about me and my fucking espresso. So, how dude. many espressos do you have a day? Well, okay. I guess there's two in Americanos, two or three. So, yeah. uh, seven. Seven. What do you have for lunch typically? Same thing, I'm sure. No, I have uh, Same like thing. maybe tuna or uh, yep. yeah, or Just like tuna. a rice bowl maybe. Yep. Brown rice. Killing it. Yeah. Um, you know, something like that. And then I know what you have late night. Late night, you I go, go to that I go, place with your friends. I go ham. You, you go to that place to with that your place friends. with my friends <clears throat> and I get every it. night. A lot. Not every yeah. night, but I get a chicken sandwich uh. and fucking fries. That's when I party that's it huh that's when i fucking party a chicken dude. sandwich and fries yeah or i get a breakfast sandwich and i fucking party you know what i envy about you what you don't really you don't really bother yourself with the issues of the world i i think about it dude i mean i what what what, what can you do what can you do i definitely 
You know, I was thinking about it the other day, like for real, like being actually real, like, you know, with the stuff that's going on with the kids and all that and how they're being ripped from their <clears throat> families and shit. Yep. Like, I don't want that to happen. Right. Every part of me doesn't want that to happen. Mm-hmm. Right. And then beyond that, what do you do? What do you do? Yeah, that, that's the, that, 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 that feeling of not being able to do anything as an individual is very real. Yeah, I mean, I... But, su- but what you can do <clears throat> is understand how that happened. Sure, and vote. And- yeah, or just understand how and why it happened. Right, but then... How it can happen again, and then you can kind of... You can make enough noise to at sure. least put it. But I know, I understand. It's, it's like you... It's like... And then people... And then things go up on Instagram where it's like... <laughs> call this number, leave a message and say the yada, yada, yada. And you're like, okay, but is this bullshit? So, but, but, the, but the problem with apathy mm-hmm. and in that is that so it's almost like, why should I follow the rules? Well, <clears throat> because it's a social contract because it simplifies things because human beings are very complicated, right? Sure. So that's why, you, that's why you follow the rules. That's why we have rules. Yeah. And so in a way, you know, it's kind of like the same reason you don't litter even though if I throw a piece of paper out the window, is it really going to make a difference in the big scheme of things from when you're flying over L.A.? No. Right. But it makes a difference because right. it's it's it makes a difference. It's in a, a mindset. Small, it's just a mindset right. that is. Infectious. It's a mindset. Yeah, yeah. But it makes a difference in a small way. Like <clears throat> if you open for me, nobody's there for you. Right. Who? The audience. Yeah. Right. No, so nobody's there for you. No, I don't open for you. Right. Mother. But if you did, though, you open nobody would be people would be like, even if people were like, oh, yeah, that guy was funny. As soon as I got on stage, people Dude, would be like, who was that? I'm, I'm going to sell out in Portland this weekend. By the way, tomorrow, Helium, then two shows Friday, two shows Saturday at Helium in Portland. Get your tickets now because Chris D'Elia is there's a good chance and there's a rumor, but it's a strong one that Chris D'Elia is going to. No, open dude, I'm not doing that. You, and I'll tell you this. You're going to be there. No, He's I won't. And open. I'll tell you this much. And if you're open. a fan of me and you're in the Portland area, don't go. Hey. That's what I want. Hey, man. Pick it. And here's the other thing, too. Pick it? If you're a real fan, fly on over to fucking Tulsa or Midwest City in Oklahoma and fucking come on to my Nobody's show, But it's going to go to Oklahoma. Yeah, right, dude. That's where I am. That's where I'm going to be this weekend. You're and be then, in Oklahoma? What club? Casino? Dude. <laughs> Did you just say club? <laughs> All right, dude. Are you at a theater? No. <laughs> no. Couldn't be, could I? You better watch your shit, man. Uh, no, Gotta... I'm, I'm doing a theater uh, tour, yeah. Except for I'm um, in Houston uh, next month, and I will be doing the club. The Houston because, Improv? Yeah, I haven't done it in a while. I like the Houston. I like Houston. You do? Uh, yeah, I know. No, Everyone's like, and In the do? summer? Fuck it, bro. I like being hot as shit. People you are do? like, you live in LA? It, what about seasons? I'm like, oh, you mean just it has the best season yeah, just all year it's round? Yeah, 75 and breezy you all the time. And then I shit and I, pu- I try to put it on their face it before oh. they run away. <laughs> Don't. You shit in your hand and throw it and out of baboon style? I play while I do it. I'm just disrespectful, dude. You're, you're super disrespectful. <laughs> um, but I'm real smart. Right, well, we can both agree on that, right? I don't know if that's true. I, I, live, I live a life of play, dude. You don't read anything. I do read. I read articles, and I also read some books. What do you read? Give me a book you've read. Okay, The Client with John, John Grisham. Now I happen to know for a fact. I asked you that question. I asked you what you read ten years ago, what? and you go, The Client. <laughs> <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> I, I say to Chris, I go, you got to read. He goes, I know, dude, but it's so hard. <laughs> oh, no. Client. No, you need, I want you to read some books. I, I do. The co- no, it, life is not just about crushing and coming. No, I know, but John Gershom is a good writer. Yeah, I know, dude, but they, we, can we move what? on? Oh, you look, you're so dumb. Your mouth is open. No, I, I, I do read. I just don't like to talk about that. Because then you... I, start to, I, I fucking start to sound like I know more shit. I don't no. like that shit. I don't like people be like, oh, yeah, you're smart. Like you, you're always trying to fucking, you know what I mean? Like showcase how fucking smart and worldly like you are. Don't like push the air in front of you like that. That's so You're always busy. trying to showcase how fucking smart and worldly you are. Chris will send me a, like a video sometimes. I'll just get a video of his hand like in a like all his fingers pushed together mm-hmm. and his thumb rubbing the his fingers going well it, that's so like i would beat you, you up if what? i was near because you because you're my young <laughs> i'm your young yeah he, chris is so disrespectful to everybody including his friends his friends there he introduces them like this he goes hey these are my sidekicks the guys in the movie with my <laughs> 
Hey, sidekicks, whatever your names are, say hi. These guys, they're, they're in movies. Hey, all you guys in a movie with five lines. Dude, you know what's, what was, what's what made me, <clears throat> one of the funniest things you ever did was when, you, when we were at the comedy store and you fucking rolled up. And I mean, this was years ago, but there were like, I guess there were like, I don't know if they were all girls. It might have been some guys, but you showed up and we were all, everyone was talking. There were like a few of us talking and and you gr- just grabbed like these guys and girls, like not grabbed them, but you put your arms around them like they were like they were asking for a picture, but they weren't. <laughs> <laughs> You're like, yeah, yeah, go ahead. Take it. Like, that's how you entered the fucking room. Oh, my God. I think about that all the time. I love that shit. I love stupid. I love doing that. Like just assuming that you're the man. Oh, it's so funny, dude. You just come in and go, I think that's, Thank w- you. that's one of the reasons why we get along so much. Oh, it's the best. It's the best to do that. To basically, I, I think my favorite thing about life is to just make a mockery of the insanity because it's a circus. And you, all, that, that's the thing. It's like nobody's really doing anything. That now, especially now, it's like the, the internet. It's like everyone just talk, 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 talk. Yeah. Fuck you. Let's, I just want to be, I want to escape, dude. You know, I, I do this, you know, my other podcast, which is now called The Brian Callen Show. We, we have fun, really smart people. But my, my buddy Hunter was like, <clears throat> we have to be careful that like when we're talking about problems, it just becomes about smart talk mm. and nothing. What does it look like in the real world? Like, I'll talk to really smart academics who write books, and they have these ideas and stuff, and I'm like, okay, good. What's that look like in the real world? Like, can I, can I implement that? And, yeah. and, and are we solving a problem that's actually tangible and measurable, or are we just well, I'll tell you what. having a conversation? Well, I'll tell you what. <clears throat> you're not. Well. You know what I mean? Because well, you're just some guy with a podcast. But I will tell you this much. Don't have a friend named Hunter. <laughs> And why would we do that? Because now that is a noun. That is not necessarily a name, right? That would be if my name was video game player. No, his name That would be like my name is, I want you to call Hunter from now on. I want you to call him video game player. Do you want to know his last name is? What? Mots. Mots. Okay, I'm out of here. No, well, it's Mots. Dutch. It's Dutch. Yeah, well, I'll tell He's you what. He's a giant Dutchman. Fucking, yeah, well, he better be a giant Dutchman yeah. because I'll tell you what, with a name like Hunter Motz, yeah. you're going to need to defend yourself. Yeah, no, he's, his brain is huge, but he can't. He's not a fighter. He's just, I challenge him. No, no, yeah. Well, you guys fighting would be interesting because it would look like, um, it would almost look like great guy. if you took if you took two dudes. Yeah. Now, and this you is put gonna... them in a large, I'm just not trying to be, but I'm just saying, right. if you took two guys, two big kind of doughy guys. No, well, I'm not doughy, You're dude. doughy. I'm, I'm taut. <laughs> you're not that taut. You're taut with a layer of, of bumpy dough over it. Dude, so I'm what? taut. Yeah, with no legs. Now, listen, if you took you two doughy guys. I got guys, teardrop. Then, I got teardrop. The teardrop. I don't know about I that. Do. Anyway, go ahead. Striations for days. And then you, yeah, 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 and yeah, the yeah. fight would look like if you put you guys together in a large cage a large, a large metal box, and then you had cameras on the middle, inside the metal box, and then you rattled the metal box back and forth so you guys were falling into each other. Like, ah, ha, ha, and trying not to fall into each other. That's what, that's what it would look like if you guys fought. What the fuck, dude? You I've can't trained fight, for fucking six years, dude. And you would still bat the air in huh. my direction. That's not cool, dude. You'd bat the air. If I grabbed hold you. Yeah. You have a tough time, dude. No. You have a tough time. No. If, I, this guy, if this boy from Jersey grabbed a hold you? You're not from Jersey. I am from you're, Jersey. You're, you're, you're coddled meat from Pasadena. I'm not from Pasadena. I never lived in Pasadena. You I moved out here in, when I was 12 you, from the fucking rough streets of Jersey. No, no. You lived... You I coined from, the term dirty you Jersey. You grew up in Pasadena in Mansion. That's not true. Yeah. La Cañada, first of all. Okay, well, your mom and put... We, jelly in your mouth every morning <laughs> and sent you off with a pat on the ass in your lunch pail. That's Kratom. That's, <laughs> this is what, what is Brendan that? and Chin are into Kratom, which is actually an addictive drug. Brendan's oh. not into it anymore. Well, don't He's do not? it. He got vertigo from it. So he found out that that's the reason why he had vertigo. So he's really? The, yeah, some of the fans stay away from it. He said that? Yeah. I wonder if it's true, Or at true, least though. he knows that that's what caused it. Because when he was off of it, he said that's when it disappeared. <clears throat> Whoa. Almost immediately. Wow. Uh, yeah. It's so cool to be into things every now and then. And you, you don't do any drugs. Hey, right? what's he doing here? Huh? Uh, no! <laughs> yep, there's your surprise. There's your surprise. No! There's your surprise. No! Will I don't so. agree to it. Will Sam I so. don't agree to it. Will I Sam don't so. agree to it. Will I don't agree to it. Will Sam so. 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 Will Sam so
<clears throat> what? Yeah, man, what? Dude, hey, hey man, what's so going what the on? fuck? Hey, wh- we got you, man. Come in here, man. Uh, uh, get in here, uh, man. Uh, 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 we got you. Uh, hey, don't mind me, man. I'm just checking in on friends. Are they rebooting punked? Nah. Is this punk? Yeah. Hey, hey, yeah. Look, hey, look, Will's got a fucking three gallon jug of water. Oh, no. Hey, and I, it's making I mean, me mad. Hey, you know, I'm just here to hang out. Don't mind me. Dude. Do your interview, guys. I don't know, because you, you, when you say that, yeah, you end yeah. up. Yeah. What's up, up, man? See? Uh, okay. There it is. All right. We, but you got to admit, we fucking got you, right, Chris? Uh, yeah. I didn't I'm know you were coming. I'm going to take my sunglasses off. I didn't know you yeah. were coming. All right. But l- l- I didn't know you were coming, so yeah. let's regroup here. Yeah. Okay. So, but pretty good. You got to admit, right? Sure. It's pretty good. Yeah, I, mean, I don't you, mean to like get in on your. Thing. No, it's okay. We've we were talking, talking about a fucking thing, by the way. <laughs> no, we were having a good fucking zero time. substance. A little bit of here. escapism, dude. I don't like to fucking talk about that shit. But Brian didn't drink his fucking bullshit. Oh, he got me that. that. I got him. Don't oh, got him a beautiful. Yeah, because yeah. he's a because he's a sweet tart tart <laughs> ass. That's no. why you're not gonna drink this. No, no, because no. I have psoriasis. It's beautiful. And it'll blow yeah, my right, what is this gonna? It's, is this it's gonna give me strawberry. Don't do it. Don't do it. Don't do it. Strawberry. Will like will. Like Will strive. suck that whole thing down. You like strive. Fight it, Will. He, I know he was joking around with you, but I'll have a few. Yeah, uh, take, take. take you have the whole thing? Take a sip. You're a take pusher, one dude. long sip. You shouldn't be that doing that. Stop. No. No, no. Will, 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 Oh. It's like the strawberries are right. sweeter than in nature because of the sugar. <laughs> right. That's why I like <laughs> it, I think. <laughs> I think that's the idea, right? That's Starbucks oh, fuck, secret. man. Nah, yeah. Dude, we got you, dude. Yeah. All right. Hey, well, Will, what you are you, Will, what have you been up to? But don't worry about me. Fucking interview Chris. Well, well I've been doing that on board. Hey, have you, guys, have you interviewed each other enough yeah. on podcasts? I asked shit? him. What, you don't know him yet? Yeah, I asked I know. him for the sound effect for how he's doing, like his life. Yeah. And he did a similar thing that you do where he went. Oh, really? <laughs> Well, I like well, to go. Well, great I, minds think likes, yeah. right? Well, what do you, what's That's the sound effect? Great minds think What's the sound effect for your life, bro? How Mine you is going? usually, Don't it's like. Like in 1940s? Yeah. It's like, uh, I know that. I know that the audience can not see it from the back. Yeah, but it's, it's, okay. more, it's more impressive from the back. Okay. okay. Oh, wow. Yeah. Here comes a fastball. There's another the fastest ball in the West. <laughs> okay. That's the bat. Right. The and ball. Japanimation. Yeah, J- Japanimation. <laughs> oh, wow. And then, and then on, it goes with. Hold on. Oh, that is cool. The people oh, talking. The ball's still going. Boop, 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 boop. Uh, oh, it satellite? passed in a satellite. Uh, satellite. Oh, satellite. satellite. Oh. It's a baseball, dude. <laughs> now it's uh, the sun. Is it a fireball. Whoa. If you can't, the sun is ninety-three miles, a million miles Vision away. Angles. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, oh, it blew up the sun. Oh, and people can't. Yeah. Uh. <laughs> Like in Terminator uh, yeah, 2. Yeah, yeah, when she's, what's yeah. What's her face? Linda Hamilton. The, like ah! the, yeah. <laughs> the guy who's going to catch the ball. Ooh. <laughs> oh, wow. That's what's your, up? That's your right, sound so, effect? Yeah. Yep. That's yeah. an amazing. He's that's hitting it out of the amazing. park. Amazing. Yeah, no. Oh, I hit it right really? out of the park. That was very visual. So for far that it went to the sun. Audible yeah. it was. Yeah. Hey, man, what are these? Drugs? That's no, a, no, no, that's no. That's Kratom. No. What the fuck is that? Those I are found huge. Those They're in dumb. They're, pocket. You, is, what, what it is is yeah. honestly. Oh yeah. Brendan and Brian are dumb, <laughs> right? Right. So yeah. so they're technically. Dumb, no, right? Okay. So, yeah. so what they do? What would is, that entail if you're dumb? So what? God, this so my... what they do is a guy, yeah. s- some guy, just anyone, let's say, <laughs> will be like, "Hey, there's a new thing." Right. Let's say, um, ingest it, right, and it's good for your health. And so they go, "Nah, never mind, man. Who cares? See no, you later." No, what? See, no, exactly. <laughs> well, that's no, no that's, that's time to see. Yeah. Oh, what the fuck? That's what I would think. Let's do a little improv. I'll be the guy. You be you. Okay, I'll be me. Okay, okay so this sure. is what so, would normally. Okay. Wait, hey, man. Who are, who are you, sir? Sorry, oh, I'm just some guy. But oh, okay. check it out. There's a new thing, uh-huh. and it's out, and you should ingest it. Oh no, thanks. Uh, go fuck yourself. Okay. All right. Yeah. Right. So that's how it goes when. Right now, now I'll do Brian. Okay. <laughs> okay. Or, or Brendan. Okay. Right. Okay. So now you right. be the guy. So this okay. will be the. This yeah. Is, hey man, what's up? Yeah. Yeah. I'm hey, just. How you doing? Some, I'm good, man. How oh, are cool. you doing? Now you just. Are you? Do I know you? No, I'm a guy. 
guy. I am some guy. Yeah, because I don't think I've ever seen you before. No, you wouldn't have. I'm okay. just some guy. So right. there's a new thing. You should get it, and you should ingest it. Give me all of it. <laughs> okay. Can you talk about it on your podcast? A hundred percent. And I hope it makes you do well yeah. and makes you money, yeah. and I will be your test subject. No. Yeah. Okay. That's a gross And now, I and cut to four months later, I have psoriasis. <laughs> <laughs> now, so these it. are what gave you psoriasis. Absolutely. So when he says, when the guy says, "Hey, have that and wash it down with that," yeah. you get psoriasis. That's yep. an oversimplification. Is it the? <laughs> Jesus, we're it's so fine. loud that we're getting banged. Like I, I, I don't want this deal. shit. What's that? I think it's Theo. Oh, yeah, it is yeah. Theo, oh, yeah. Fuck. Who's Theo? Theo Vaughn. I don't know who Theo is. The I've never met Theo. Theo Vaughn? Theo Vaughn? V-A-U-G-H-N? Because that's how you spell it. The great that. Theo Vaughn, you bastard. V- Vaughn. V-O. We just got Theo mad. <laughs> Wait, he's he's in the next studio? Yeah, yeah. he's doing his podcast. Oh, well. And we're we'll drowning him out. Yeah. Yeah, <clears throat> yeah, you know what we're drowning him out with, too? No, and then the ball. Okay. Chris has a Chris has veins in his head, You're and you know what that dude. means? I can always vascular, see a vein. Vascular. It means that something's gonna pop, and you're gonna die. Well, we all are one day, and no, you know what? Death is, to quote the great whatever rapper said this. Yep. But Santini. You can. Nope. Death is just the moment that dying ends. Well. I hate oh, that. Fuck. That's a great rapper You're said that. Die. I can't remember. His name escapes me right now. Die but. Soon. Tone Loke. No, it wasn't Tone, Tone Loke. Tone Loke kind of did Loke. more like Funky Comedy yeah. or whatever. Hey, you yeah. gotta get the... He makes people ingest this and you get horny. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 That's true. That's a good Tone Loke. Yeah, I've been working on some of my You've been working on rappers. Tone Loke f- <laughs> for a while now. 26 <laughs> years. You do, you do impressions. On, uh, oh, man, I do so you many do, impressions. You ready to hear some Tone Loke? Yeah. Sure. Well, that's wild thing. That's good. It's, you know what I like? How What you captured is how insecure Tone Loke is. Yeah, yeah. I, well, uh, well, uh, uh, funky, cold, you know. Yeah, yeah, you know. Yeah, yeah. In the middle of it. It's really good. <laughs> He's one of the most insecure rappers. Yeah. yeah. Thanks for the memory. Well, what okay. are you doing back in LA, Jack? Don't worry about me, man. You oh, guys yeah, fucking you... do your thing. Hey, I get, I get I saw Chris in apparently your hometown. You know, Chris and I fucking lit it up. Yeah, we did. Oh, in New, New York. York. In New York. New York. Big city of dreams. That's right. Oh. I get this from, from Will as I'm. I mean, I just get this. Hey, let's general. slow it down and read some <laughs> yeah, text. Yeah, dude. Read, <laughs> we don't need... Scroll The way three back. of us can't have a conversation. Yeah. Well, I, three of us. I get this. I get... Mm, oh, good. No, just no, out of nowhere. Yeah, no. Suck me off. And yeah. then I get... I just land in L.A. I'm too tired to say it in Italian. Say something I don't like. I'll slap you around. Nice. <laughs> yeah. yeah. The, See, that was the New York feeling that I had when I yeah. landed You're in not New York. York bro. Dude, I was in New Jersey in New York. Chris Doing a movie? Uh, yeah, I was doing a movie. Chris, Chris was in town. Yeah. We we hung out. We went. We fucking we did it. We ate steaks. We, we lit fucking it up. we <laughs> lit it up. We had pasta. Yeah, we had we, pasta. We stopped by. Got it at a car. We got a cannoli. Dude, yeah. we lit it. Oh, up. we went to that clear staircase in Times Square. We took some pictures. <laughs> so Forget not, it, right? Forget it. Not in we New took York. a picture yeah. with Iron Man. Uh, yeah, go fuck a yourself. A fucking smelly Iron Man who's coming apart at the seams. Took a <laughs> took a picture of a fucking. <laughs> Portly Iron Man, yeah. and also fucking uh, uh, Wario. There was a big Wario. Yeah, we there's took a, a picture with Wario. yellow Mario. Dude. Yeah, yeah. There was a <laughs> big Wario, a, a big fucking Wario. Yeah, Puerto Rican gentleman with who was uh, had a Wario head on. Tund Wario. Hey, 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 yeah. who, who, who are you playing in this movie? Some guy. No, neighbor? I'm not playing some guy. Oh, maybe if he is playing some guy, you could give him something to ingest. No, come on. <laughs> now, dude, I have a question for you, Brian. Yeah, what? And yeah, do what? you want to hear the specials here? Mm-hmm. Or did you just feel like getting a good old fashioned grand slam? <laughs> because that's what you got, dude. That's what you got right dude, there. Dude, you did get served you up. You got a served up slam. piping hot, all American fucking slam. Man, you're you need a an ass whooping. I'll man. tell you this much. I took a <laughs> shit twenty five minutes ago yeah. and it's here and I'm not moving. <laughs> yep. What? It doesn't smell because I take my medicine. That's so disrespectful. And I don't give a shit, dude. That's how much I don't give a fuck. Are you at least wearing diapers? Nope. I'm not even wearing underwear. And I have a hole in my jeans. I can see it right now. Yep. It's 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 steaming out. The only reason it's not slipping over the end of that chair is because he's making an indent. Right. And he's sitting in there. It's all in his shit. You know what I'm doing? What? Stewing. Why is it? Why is it bone white? Did you eat? Did you swallow a hamster? No, I. Why I? Bones are white. Shits fucking, white. He I shits shit white. Little dude. crusties like a dog. I'm, I'm goose. Yeah, goose. I'm goose. That's from next salon. 
<laughs> yeah. It's going to turn green when I leave. Your yeah. shit is so, it's ivory white, bro. Yep. Yeah. I shit ivory white. That's what my snake eats. Are you ingesting bones? N- no. You just a goose? You just, you, you, you. You have you would have a snake for real though. Huh? I used to I used to have a Burmese Why python. Did you have a ball python. That's stupid. I was an eccentric kid and I always loved serpents. Mm. I've always I- been imagine well, saying I've always loved serpents. <clears throat> yeah. Dude, wow. how about how, did you see the guy who was getting choked by the fucking snake because he he rescued it and then he was trying to take selfies with it? No. no. Oh, he was he almost died. He was like he was getting so serious. It was an in it was like in Really? India or something in probably. Borneo or something. But like um yeah, it was so, it was like, he was, it was so scary. Like, really? it was terrifying. I tweeted about it if you can't find it. That's the guy, yeah. Oh, my goodness. Well, that's a, that's, a, that's, a, that's called a Burmese python. It's obviously in India. That's a, that's a Burmese <laughs> python. <laughs> that is. And, and I believe. Look at that. I'm almost sure that's a Burmese python. It sounds oh, like something that could happen. Look at, look at that. Look like, at that. Look yeah. at that. How terrified would you be yeah, at that but moment? Is there a video of it? Yeah, there is. I'll find it. Yeah, there is. I'd, I'd fucking shit right there, to be brutally honest Not with me. you. Not me. I just put, peel. You take the tail and you start peeling and you'll be fine. Oh, really? Yeah. Dude, that's crazy. You're so smart when it comes to... Thank you, man. Thank you. All right. That's a Burmese python. I, that's what I had. Hey, Bri, shut that's up. That's exactly what I had. <laughs> Why did you have that? Um, because I, there, and he got so fucking mean. He was so mean. Answer the that question. He would bite, and I just was into it. Now they're freaking the snake out because they're idiots. Mm. And see that snake is getting scared, and he's holding the head. Yeah, you don't know that. Brian. I do. I know. Brian sna- I'm a herpetologist. No, you don't know that. It could I'm just an, be hungry. I'm an amateur herpetologist. He's squeezing that head too much. Now he's shaking the head. Now it gets crazy. Now this is bullshit. But, but wait, no, it doesn't even get crazy until I think he starts walking away. Oh, this yeah, this yeah, is yeah, the part. Why Oof. is he walking away? But look at the hero that helps him. Look at that. That's cool. Yeah. Brian would be shitting himself in the corner. <laughs> no, it was complete bullshit. Eating a popsicle. That, wasn't sca- that wasn't doing shit to him. Bro, in one second, that thing would have fucking wrapped up, around. Chris, yeah. you're such a pussy. I mean, this guy, took, you have to been around snakes, dude. I've been to India, dude. What was India like? It was, I was, <laughs> dude, you, you're a, you're a, you know what? A you're a hard hitting interviewer. You really are. <laughs> Why don't I interview you guys? Okay. 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 All right. Sure. Hey, guys. what's up? Welcome to the fighter and kid. I'm sitting in for Brian and Brendan here with well, me is Brian's Brian here, but, yeah. but Chris is here also. Okay. Yeah. Hey, uh, got a lot uh, going on around today. These guys are doing comedy and they're doing, uh, okay. all sorts of stuff in, in the business and show yeah. business at sure. large. Yep. Um, Brian, what are these on the table? Fuck That's that shit. A- Chris, <laughs> you're, um, <laughs> so wh- how'd you get started in comedy? What were you being a fucking smart ass, breaking everyone's balls and Man. shit? No, I and mean, your family yeah. and your friends. And then you're like, I'm funny, right? I mean, probably I- same thing for you, right? Well, no, actually. All right. uh, me undies. <laughs> No, no, guys, think, uh, dude, that's not our sponsor, man. Really? It's not. Well, it's it, my maybe, sponsor. Just, it is my. Yeah, you're part of the Mondays fam anymore. <laughs> no, I, you, look. You got burlap underwear. What you got? No, I, I have. Oh, you can't wear any underwear. I'm wearing the undies right now. Psoriasis. No, I don't make fun of me about my psoriasis. I'm Let's see your dick. Let's see what you're wearing. What, oh. why, why do you have psoriasis? Oh, From Calvin, Calvin. Klein. Those are, that's great. Yeah, because I used to model for them when I was in the nineties. <laughs> I got money. I have Mondays. I, I wear mostly Mondays. I got. What are you wearing? Okay. Don't pull. Oh God! You you would just have another <laughs> pair of shorts. Big legs. Under. I think these you are, would. These are Kirkland. Oh, those big God. legs. Don't pull yeah, them out sure, that far, so. dude. Are those like? Don't costal? yank them out. You're wedging yourself. You're, Kirkland. Your balls are getting all fucking. <clears throat> hey, dude! All seriousness, you're you're a big guy with a powerful lower body. Yeah. When you when you're when you're gonna make love and yeah. the the girl's like, here comes this big guy, yeah. and then the, then you pull out yeah. that that My sad dick. nub. What? <laughs> what? What? Does the girl go? Oh. No, no, no. What happens is, anything? nope. She looks at me She's and then I get undressed and she goes, well, that all makes perfect sense. Uh. Right. But what she doesn't understand is that I'm, it's scaled to me. Uh. But then as I get closer, it's like, oh no, because uh. I'm seven foot five and yeah. 872 pounds. Right. So then Not that when you, but yeah, yeah. yeah. I think and then is. when it, <laughs> and then when it gets closer, yeah. then it looks like an overstuffed fucking one of those sandwiches <laughs> on a French bread. That, uh, like you're talking like you'd get from Jersey Mike's. Yeah. The kind of you burrito. You got a Jersey Mike's. Yeah. Cock. I got a Jersey so you Mike's. you got extra flaps of skin just kind of hanging off. Yeah. It looks like, fucking, you got a cock that, and they make it Mike's way. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. The end of my dick looks like a handful of bologna. Just 
Japanese oh, fucking nice. Why? different foreskin. Because I'm European. Yeah, yeah. yeah oh, yeah, yeah. I'm yeah. European. Yeah, so you, you didn't, didn't fucking give a, cut you didn't it. Get you it didn't cut, cut it. it. No, I got cut. it. I got it. I got it cut more to make it shape like a rose. Oh, oh that's pretty cool. Yeah, actually. I got it all. Oh, I got a beautiful. Oh, God. Yeah, I visited. <laughs> Oh. I got body modifications as a baby. Uh, that's that's oh, no. problematic, yeah, but yeah, I got right. a piercing that's keeping my balls very small oh. and do you, close you, do together. Do you have pearls under the skin? Yeah, pearls. Yeah, oh, no, wow, that's beautiful. I feel bad about coming and you know saying like. I feel bad about like coming here and then being like, oh, you know. Yeah, that's very you to actually to think of that. Yeah, yeah, because yeah, you you do you do something and then feel bad about it. It's very yeah. you. Yeah. But well, we. I'm, like that I, you're here. You're, uh, yeah. <laughs> we're, we'd rather have you here than not to be brutal. Hey, man, honest. it's awesome. You know, right. we're making a surprise. So Can you believe his face when it happened? Yeah, well. He right. was like, what? Yeah. I mean, I was surprised, but yeah. I don't think that was We got surprising. you. We were thinking about it. We talked about it all. Guess what? What? Like yesterday. Yeah. We wanted yeah. to get you. <laughs> well, that's when you would make the plan. I, I actually didn't even know that you were in town, so double yep. the surprise. Yeah, yeah, I flew back into town. Because you're fucking so New York, dude. Dude, I am <laughs> so New York. I am so fucking New York. That's not true. Chris, Chris, I was in New Jersey, mm -hmm. and uh, I was making a film, but I was right close to the city. The the Bad Apple, the big... It's the yeah, well, city of of shoulders, man. Right. No. And everybody was and and so Chris, I got to visit Chris while he yeah. was in town. Yep. And then he went and did uh, the does theaters. Chris, does Chris count how many times he gets recognized? No, I. I you know what? I can't. It's actually tough. <gasps> yeah. I wear a baseball hat and sunglasses. So and nobody, I literally, literally, people are like. I know him from somewhere, but yeah, I don't normally see that guy with a hat and sunglasses on, so it can't be him. Yeah. I hear people saying that. Have you ever heard about? Uh, have you ever heard about the people living underneath the subway? Yeah, yeah, mole people. Yeah, uh, in yeah. in New York, mm -hmm. there's people in the in the there's a whole community. Yeah, yeah, well, there's well, there's different subway tunnels yeah. that uh, <laughs> the trains don't go down anymore. Yep. So a lot of people who are homeless have, have ha set up these cardboard yeah. cities down That's there. What they deserve, and it's pitch well, black. Huh? <laughs> Dude, hey, well, it's not what no deserve don't it. hey man it, it, don't derail yeah, what, his what, bit. Was, what was going to be okay. so awesome I, to do by your way, thing go on. i knew that yeah go and on. you knew that no, i knew on. it because yeah. i know a lot about comedy okay, okay, dude, now, well, but then brian, all right there's brian dude, that yeah. knows little no yeah, that's comedy. not but true. brian but when someone's teeing something up mm -hmm. and they fucking take the tea and it says anecdote on the T. Exactly. And then they take a ball and right. it says like punchline. It also underneath in parentheses says take it or leave it. Not a huge deal. Yeah, but but just but here still, it comes. Yeah, here it's and they put up. it right. And they put it on top of the T. And there's a batter. Right. And there's a batter. And the batter's you. And it batters me and I come up and I'm fucking showing my underwear. By the, way, the batter's you. Yeah. A a very established Comedic actor. Thank you very okay, much, Chris. Okay, guys. That, that is very hilarious. Much, and a I sketch that. actor. I appreciate to that. To boot. Hey, you know what? And you'd figure, oh, also, by the way, hey, known him a while. No, no, known him a little while. Now, guys, this is Had my- Had conversations. No, this is so, my so show. So sitting across, now you, sitting with a couple of the funniest people on the planet. Yeah. Now, he knows you too, right? What the fuck? I do know him. So now, if you were just going to tell like a story or something, yeah. maybe he'd say, all right, I'm going to sit over here. I'm going to have a smoke break. I'm no, going to let him drive for a little while. Or are you going to come up with something that makes- no sense. I just is said, not relevant. I just and, said they deserve. Yeah, but you and know toss what, it in. You know what you did, dude? <laughs> what? You took a fucking bowl of spaghetti and you dumped it out onto that baseball on the tee. Yeah, and and the reason why I say that is you might be like, well, I don't, oh, that makes no sense. Yeah, that's exactly my point. No. Yeah. What you do yeah. makes no sense. Okay, man. You're, this is my show. It doesn't I have, have anything to do with guys. baseball. I, I have everything to do with I have to right remind there. you guys. You that, took a bowl of pasta no, you're and put it into the fucking baseball no, game. No, no, no. And <laughs> now, and now, as you're explaining it to him, he's saying, no, I understand, and it won't happen again, and he's got a bucket of chocolate ice cream, and he's dumping <laughs> no. it onto the pasta I don't like and metaphor. mashing it into the plate with his foot while he's telling you, I know that I dropped this <laughs> right. bowl of pasta on the ground, Look, dude. but at least maybe we can pick it Tell up me about the and mold, still have people. some. Uh, okay, I was all I was going to say was that um, I went down there and it was very very dark and I still got recognized. Of course, that didn't happen. <laughs> of course, and it's not that big a deal. But you know what? Just, Had it been in the moment that you were doing it, it could have been amusing. Could have been funny. Not only that, could have led to, led to some other stuff. Yeah, right? isn't that right? Guys. Now, <laughs> can it now? Now, can it? 
can it now? <laughs> no, it can't, can it? No. So what did we learn, Bri? Yeah. I not to don't like that you're putting what? your hands in your lap. I'm not your fucking student. You guys are my guests. I'm uncomfortable with the fact that we are show. sitting here in the TFAT K studios. Yeah. The, the show has been so successful that yeah. you know your show's been successful when your logo's been turned into some sort of uh, like bathroom uh, they, tile. Fan uh, no, no, what I was It's incredible. No, 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 There's so many incarnations. Now, what I will say is what? if they were very successful, this wouldn't be broken. Uh, <laughs> but Chris, right? that's, so get a new sign. I got to stick up no, for Brian here. That is that is the style. Yeah, that's not fair, dude. You're being unfair right now. It's broken. Like all no, those are not. No, those that's, are. That's like a right. tile work thing. It's a tile well. work thing, yeah. bro. It's broken. Yeah, no, nah, it's not broken. But I'll tell Glass. you, I'll tell you, uh, if you've got a studio where there's all sorts of, there's a really cool, like, what would this be? Steampunk? Well, this, this clock whatever, over here. This would be a would guy be made us that clock. A guy sent us. That a guy clock. sent you that clock. Uh, yes. Uh, all right. Now, now so you, I didn't know you knew Gargamel. <laughs> <laughs> Is I that will admit, it's a clock? Little, it's a little goth, but yeah. it's, it's, it's it's pretty it's, cool. I think I a, saw. Yeah. I, oh, bless <laughs> you! Whoa, I am Jesus. allergic to fucking boringness. Huh? <laughs> Isn't that crazy? I'm this, I saw this clock in a Ramstein video <laughs> okay. in 1994. But you've got all sorts of cool stuff in here that tells everybody that you guys are established, yep. yeah. and it's a it's a very successful podcast. And still, you know, little about comedy. Right, Isn't man. that crazy? Right? That's so crazy. That the, crazy the, right? With the See? broken glass. Hold on. Collage Hold on. as my. Hold on. You. Oh, God. Oh, dude. What yeah. the fuck? Was that Brian's career? <laughs> oh, sorry. I banged on the wall. Now Theo oh, dude, you, gonna think you, now listen, you fucking knocked over one you, of his you things. You sit better than that. No, this is better. Yeah, look at the way he's sitting this right now. This is better, dude. Hold on. Look at the way he's fucking sitting. This how, I got to videotape sit, that. Man. You, you sit. Cover your fucking. For real. <laughs> fuck it. Don't. Don't sit like that. That's I gotta sit so, like that, dude. That's it's so, so comfy. Comfy. That's what you were so disrespectful. Say. It is dis- it's respectful because I'm being the way you. you've got me and I'm being all as much of me as I can be. No. Comfort is softening it up. Zero reason. How about how Brian's this? videoing this yeah. when there's seven cameras in here? <laughs> that's well, pretty fucking weird. Still, I have to do that. Yeah. All right. <laughs> uh, Will, how long are you in LA for? Uh, who gives a shit, Why? dude? What the fuck, man? Hard-hit. You guys both a- ask hard hitting questions. Yeah, let's go to some some current events. I want to okay. get their take on the world. Oh. Well, that Trump thing was one of them. Uh he apparently signed or he's going to sign an executive order that doesn't allow the families to be separated anymore. Well, that's They good. talked about this yeah. earlier. Yeah, I heard about this. Yeah, so that we well, made that announcement take it today. Away. Uh that's uh that, yeah, that's really good. It's an old law that should uh, should never have been encountered in this way. There's absolutely no Excuse for taking uh, children away from parents, so let's all shut up about it and make sure it's good now I'm, I'm, so everyone can <laughs> shut up about it so that we can have a, a ground floor that is parents and children together, which but, we never but, should have not had, unless so that everyone in. can say, hey, guess what? It's better. Uh, we know it's better to have the children. We know that. Unless you're in the orphanage business. <laughs> what, unless you're in the orphanage business. Yes. It's not, it shouldn't be a business. It's not There's a business. Your, well, we do have to take into account that the orphanages orphanage business, haven't been. The orphanage business takes a hit <laughs> when they don't have kids <laughs> that, no. they can, that they can give off. Brian, it's terrible to, enough. No, no, Brian, but, but listen. It's absolutely that, heinous to have the children away from the parents to begin with. I agree. This law should have never been. I it, agree. it should have never even have even existed. I hear and you. And any time that happens, it's bad. Yes. Look, you want to you want to further the suffering? Well, no. I and just keep think, the orphanages let's, open. Look, look, let's look, keep look, let's look. keep in mind that orphanages are taking look, a hit. Look, That's all I'm saying. Dude, I've been everywhere, okay? I've been everywhere. Not really, but... No, I've been everywhere. <laughs> well, hey, dude, give him, right. give him Jacksonville. What? Give kids Jacksonville. Give them Jacksonville. Give the families and the kids, give them Jacksonville. <laughs> Let me tell you something. Jacksonville fucking sucks donkey balls. <laughs> Jesus, dude. Just fucking let them have it. Hey, man. Yes. What you the did. fuck? You've been through Jacksonville a few times, I would imagine, in your travels doing yeah. comedy, right? And dude, I'll tell you one thing, man. <laughs> yeah? It sucks fucking donkey balls. Hey, man. Yeah, it's not the north or the south. It's like, what the fuck? Get it together. Jacksonville, hey. Oh, you got a Whole Foods? Congrats to the fuck Jeez, dude. Jeez, man. Okay. Yeah. Rolling your eyes and dude, shit. Dude, I'm terrible. playing Jacksonville. 
I'm playing Jacksonville coming up in the fall. And guess what? I know it sucks, donkey balls. No, I'm still going. <laughs> Jeez, well, Chris, that's really charitable. You of can't you, just Chris. do that on stage. Yeah. They're not gonna. They're not I gonna will. enjoy that. I will. Oh fuck, man! At that point, I'll already have their money. <laughs> God, God, but Chris, it's months from now. How are you gonna so do that? So mercenary. I already sold a bunch of things. Ah, oh, jeez, dude, dude. Yeah, but let them have Jacksonville. Let them have places. You know, Dayton. Dayton, Ohio. Dayton, Ohio. I've been it's there. A, that's a legit town, dude. Sure. Isn't the yeah. Ohio separated by a river? <clears throat> I don't by know. The Ohio Something river. like that. Yeah, Ohio River probably. That sounds familiar. Delaware. Yeah. Give them half of it. Sail that river. Delaware. Delaware what? is not big enough. Delaware. You big know why? Enough. Kids need room. Why? Because what about the donkey balls? Sucks them. What? What about the donkey balls? Jackson. It sucks them. I don't know. Delaware. Delaware sucks those balls. Nah, they're cool places. I'm kidding. <laughs> <laughs> so that's your. We all answer. know I joke. That's your answer? I went to Tampa Bay once, and I didn't get near the bay, and I could have been anywhere. Yeah. That's I'll my story. I'll be in Tampa. That's a good story. Oh. In July. Uh, what's our? Thanks for solving this problem. What's our next current event? So the current events are, I don't know why, there's just terrible stories everywhere. It's so okay. uh, do you guys know a rapper named XXXTentacion? Yeah, you do know about this guy. So he was shot and killed while trying to buy a motorcycle. Yesterday, right? Two days ago? Trying to buy a motorcycle? Yeah, he was only 20 years old. You don't know this Shit. guy? I, I don't know him. Yeah, I, yeah. I read about this. He, apparently, all the artists think he's like one of the best talents out there, super inspired by it him. It sucks. Uh, yeah. I'm well, uh, I'm pretty well versed in his music. The guy was a real talent. Really? Like, like a real, the yeah. real deal, real talent. Fuck. Yeah. However, he was an, an, like an awful guy. Oh, really? Um, yeah. Like, like, an, like there were, have been like some exposés on him that is just like his ex girlfriend, like, he was very depressed, right? He was. Yeah, a, he was. Yeah, he was. In, he was just. I mean, you know, damaged. Look, all I'm saying is, if like the whole believe women movement is a great thing, and if you do believe women, then yeah. then this guy was a real mm. awful, awful he, guy. He, get, he, yeah, he did some bad awful shit. guy. So it's it's a weird thing, you know, to think about because he, the artist separating the artist and what he's done uh, artistically with. Well, what do you like, actually? That's a good like. What do you? Brian's think about seen that? every one of Roman Polanski's movies. Yeah, right. no, but but I mean yeah. for real, that's you a good know example. Him by heart, right? Like, so if somebody's a ghastly human being but makes yeah. incredible art, that still means you can enjoy their art, right? Mm. Well, does he? Does, <laughs> no, but, do but does he make no. incredible art, or does he just kind of? Is he just kind of a ghastly human being? <laughs> Who? No, well, Sal- <laughs> oh no, fart head over here. No, don't call me Sweet fart head. Tart- and boy. don't dismiss me with your hand like that. Don't um, whistle in my direction. Uh, but he what? But but it's not my sound effect. <laughs> No. Yeah, it is. No. But he was a, no. he, 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 honestly, his music was really fucking good, man. I know, yeah. but. And, and, and I'm not, and look, look, now look, if all that shit. It sucks that he was But it does like suck that. because you was like, well, I don't want to, then I don't want to support the guy. Oh, no, Absolutely but also, no, 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 but he's also 20. He's also fucked up. He's also depressed. It doesn't mean he can't change and all that. It still, it still sucks. Well, he that's killed. true. But what, what, so what, do they know anything else? He was buying a motorcycle and the guy shot him? Well, apparently the guy. <clears throat> was shot and robbed because he was posting, oh. you know, a lot of these rappers are like, you know, they're flaunting what they have. So apparently he was like, I'm going to the motorcycle shop right now to buy a fucking motorcycle with cash. Jeez. This is what I heard. And, and he had a Louis Vuitton bag on him and they fucking pulled up yeah. on him, robbed him, shot him in his car and fucking they robbed him. him. Yeah. Okay. See, that's what's up. That is so fucked up. And that's and sort the, of, isn't that interesting? How, how social media, Another, oh, yeah. another evil, another yeah, direct yeah, yeah. evil, a direct evil that can come from it. You can get shot and killed because you're flossing. Well, I know people. Jesus. Yeah. And, and also and also the, 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 the thing. I mean, it's just it's 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 like that lifestyle, too. Well, it's also it, it's, if you're it, a black male in this country, you're like something like 25 times or some crazy amount more likely to die than, yeah, than well, you know, anybody else. But I just it's <clears> like <throat> the the anybody else. And the yeah. like Brian's fucking stat was yeah. like bye bye murder. Started bye sound murder. But also, I, also, I love talking about stats. Yeah, yeah. Brian was but, like going with a stat and but, um, <laughs> bailed on it. Yeah, said, hey, but, yeah twenty five yeah, times more. I can't run it. Like, I, I don't care. But but <laughs> this, <laughs> keep going, keep going. Hey, no, but it's just fu- it's just it's just I don't know what I was you know what fun. guys. What? I like hanging with you guys. Ah, okay. fuck off. Okay. I like it. I like fuck it. Fuck off, Will. You're two of the funniest guys Did that you know ever it? was. was. Okay. And uh, oh, drunk. Was I'm that? having a good time you're with you. You're drunk. Oh, God, you're drunk. All right, you're so next, heroine. Heroine. next current event with this fucking water guzzling. Okay, so uh, we talked about the Chris Hardwick, Hard, Hardwick story uh, yeah. on Monday. Mm-hmm. And oh, then Brendan nice. mentioned that 
I guess his girlfriend did, his ex-girlfriend did text him a lot before, you know, this story came out that oh. she wanted to reconcile. Really? So the texts are out now. <gasps> and uh, oh, wow. this is basically hey, all her texts. And he didn't okay. respond to her at all. This is after they broke, after he broke up with her. Oh, this was, okay. Hey, when can we, okay, will that be ever happen? We both handled this poorly, possibly myself more so. I'm sorry I shouldn't have texted you. I, ju- I think I just got caught up in a wave. I hope things are awesome with you. Seven months after the split. Wow. Hmm, interesting. But now she's mm. now mad. she wrote that thing. Well, that's what I said. Is I said it, it, it's one thing to confront somebody like you know personally, but when you go when you go public with that letter, you are it's it's a revenge piece. You are trying to hit them where they live. Yeah. You're actually trying to publicly shame them and ruin their <clears> career. <throat> that's a fact. And it, and <clears throat> and just just at least at least be honest with that. If you want to, if you want to destroy somebody, that's what you're trying to do. It's not about closure. It's not about you asserting your right. You're, you do that it's, like one on one with somebody. Yeah. When you when you out somebody in the public square like that, it's not to me, yeah. it's not something I respect. Mm. I just don't. And also, seven months later, you're still trying to get back together with them. But now what? What about yeah. that? Wait, this is seven months after the after split. Yeah. They've oh, been God, apart yeah. for a yeah. few yeah, years for, now. Right? So it's what about that person. now? Like, can I don't understand. And also, you were with him for three years. I, if he was, if he was that way, where is your role in it? Do, don't you have a responsibility to walk the fuck away? And if you didn't, shouldn't you say next time I will? And that was on me at the end of the day after three years. It's interesting right now, man. It's really interesting. I mean, it's fucking interesting. You can just come out and say, here are these bad fucking things yeah. that happened. And then, uh, yeah, he got dinged by uh, he got I mean, dropped that, that, by that, the yeah. old thing. But, but the, these, look, these, that, these, these companies drop you right away. No, that, that's problematic. But look, the, 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 you know, emotional abuse is a real. Of course thing. it is. Of course, yes, and, of course. And, and it I is. know you know that. But, 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 uh, I, you know, I don't know what to think of this Chris Hardwick thing. I, I, I mean, you usually hear stuff about it. I had no idea that this this was like I never heard anything like this about Chris Hardwick. Yeah. Mm. So, I, and I'm not saying that that means it's not true. I have no fucking idea. I don't know why uh, a woman would. I just don't. Say for me, I think all didn't. of us behave in certain ways in relationships, and there are times in those relationships where neither party wants anybody to know about it because we don't. I have, I have acted abhorrently with my own wife, the mother of my children, in fights and said shit that I didn't mean. But no one would ever hear that because I've heard you on several occasions, now not to make light of the situation, tell her, let's not talk in public at restaurants because everybody recognizes me. Yeah, you do say that. That's what Brian says. Because we'll be hanging at Brian's house, inside the house, before a few people go out for dinner, and he'll say, Amanda, through clenched teeth. Amanda, don't. Talking to me, thing because yep. everybody recognizes me. Well, also, and when you she doesn't do, refer to me as Mister Callan, it makes right. And you also have the thing where you say, "Let's." Do, you tell her like, "Do the Japanese," and what you mean is walk ten feet behind me when yeah. I walk. Well, do the Japanese. Yeah. <laughs> that um, it, you, that's what you call it. You say, "Do the Japanese, sweetheart," yeah. Yeah. and she stands there as you keep walking. Now you, yeah. you know yeah. it, it's gets, interesting. Yeah. Sometimes you go for dinner and then you have your evening constitutional afterwards, and sure the. Men may be walking behind as the women are uh, forward or vice yeah, versa. Right. Well, I do that. It to, just to means protect. the guys want to catch up. Right. But I know the, the scenario that Chris is talking right, right, about right, here. Exactly. here. And because it was a dinner that the four of us attended, uh-huh. us three and your wife. Yes. And still, she had to do the Japanese. I yeah. don't remember that. We wa- yeah. We were walking I, through. We were walking now. down Abbott Kinney. I don't yeah. remember that. Yeah, where that Chris is. loves to go. He recommended the restaurant. I, I love he loves going Abbott Kinney. He loves going to restaurants and he loves Venice. This is a lie. Chris, you've never been to a restaurant in Abbott Kinney. What restaurant was? It I was some Italian dude. It was that one word, beautiful, place. really nice. Pl- Mangio, yeah, something or like in Italian. Pop, no. I don't speak Pop, it. Uh, See, you guys are lying. Some, yeah, you guys are goddamn really nice. lying. It was really nice. You, know you what it was? had it was what? quaint. I had no, no, super quaint. You're trying I mean, to assassinate my normal. character. You had the pair with Gorgonzola no, and for, for, lamb. Just start, just, no, yeah, just no, a little, a little terrine is a word. You know what? I just went regular. I got the fucking linguine and pink sauce because you kind of can't beat that. You kind of can't fucking beat that. Get like a nice vodka sauce. You guys are assassinating my character. And then after, and I had, I had. Mm-hmm. Uh, lovely, uh, no. I had a lovely. Uh, I had the. I had a fennel I salad. It was lovely. Yeah, I had fennel, and it was just a little cracked. Right, and then you. Uh, and then after that, I was like, you know what? 
I've been hearing about it. Yeah. I have some mutton. I'm going to have the mutton here. Yeah. Do you remember? Yeah, yeah. 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 yeah, you do remember. So now you just so confirm that nice, it's real. So you confirmed nice it's mutton real. Chop, and they have the sides that usually wrap around mm-hmm. with a mutton yeah. chop. Right. And they flay them out. It's the bacon uh, cut, yep. and they call them the ears. And my wife wasn't, and was permitted, my wife wasn't permitted to eat right. yeah. until that was we the first were done. And, and then after we, we, we finished, we were walking, taking a walk to where the cars were, and you said, sweetheart, you go like this, remember. Yeah. And she said, you want me to? And then you finished her sentence and said, do the Japanese. Yeah. And then she walked 10 feet behind us mm-hmm. for blocks and blocks. Well, I, yeah. I, I'm, old, while you, I'm old fashioned. Yeah, while you talked about stocks I'm, and yep. golf. And, and you know what shit. you mentioned? I'm old fashioned. You know what you mentioned? Yeah. Stats. Stats. I'm, you I'm some stats. stats. I'm old fashioned. You mentioned inner city uh, uh, stats from Chicago. Mm-hmm. That you started talking about here's some gun violence shit but that you have no fucking right. I'm old fashioned. You don't know anything about because no. you've never lived there, yep. and you're chiming in you on uh, double X. You don't know guy like no, you fucking know double X guy, and everyone's gonna be like Brian. You don't know shit. You don't know, and so we don't know yet you what happened, know. Chris Hardwick. Well, anyway. Yeah, it's going to be good. Uh, we, I listen, here's what we got to do, all right? Here's all right. what we're going to do. We're going to oh, get God. through this. No, here's what's up, because everyone's like, okay. you know, look, here's, you know, I don't think anybody wants uh, anyone to deal with uh, the likes of, uh, you know, oh, this is old news, who gives a shit, and been around for a fucking year, this whole thing, but the fucking, you know, Harvey Weinstein's yeah. of the world, and that, okay, so I think we got all, everyone who can uh, societally understand the difference between good and bad, cool. Now we got all this shit. Let's have a different news channel for it. Yeah. What do you, what, what do you just mean? a news channel that does this. Yeah. Uh, the Me Too stuff? Yep. Well, the, 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 there's a difference between the Me Too stuff and then there's a difference between... It, I just feel like any time... If you're going to air Got him that out, again. if you're going to air oh, that oh, out... Oh, <laughs> oh, fuck. I didn't Come even on, know if I... stepped into that like yeah. a bunch of witch. I was like, yeah, no, how no, do we no. button this? It's yep, unfortunate yep, for everyone and go. things are going to get ugly and separate, the fists are going to fly. And I was like, news channel. Yeah. Well, I don't know. I was just kind of like going, eh, that's fucking... I, 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 you know what? That wasn't even a good attempt. What would it be called? I kind of did I kind of did toss it up to you to fucking keep talking about it. Callan's stand-up, God, you'd be hard-pressed to find something funnier than Callan's stand-up. Except for Callan when he's serious. <laughs> <laughs> All right, dude. Let's move on with these bastards. <laughs> right, these... Brian Callan coming to town this weekend. That's hey, right. Let and me tell Portland, you something. Oregon, You'd be hard pressed to find a funnier guy, <laughs> unless he's being serious. We'll be right back for news, weather, traffic. And then you hear that, and you're like, "What the fuck were you guys talking about in the break?" No, no, no. We're just uh, so you're here. You're in uh, Dayton, Ohio, no, 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 you, Portland, you, oh, Helium Port- this weekend. Oh, yeah. Come watch him up. Do a couple minutes, Will. Yeah, I don't. Well, I'm not really Why don't a you fly up and do a couple. Okay. Minutes? Yeah. All right. Yeah. I'll all throw right, you up. Yeah. Well, I don't. That's not really Portland, where they're shut and where they're picketing white owned. Uh, white-owned restaurants because they're 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 cooking ethnic food. Are they really? Yeah. What? Oh yeah. Wait, Shut they're down. what? They're well, because if you're a white-owned, if you're a white owner of a restaurant, but you're serving a fusion of ethnic food, no, they're culturally not. appropriated. It's got to be more oh, to yeah. it than that. There sure ain't. This 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 burrito thing. These two white women who'd gotten to Mexico and figured out a way to make these amazing burritos. They were shut down because they were they were appropriating Actually, Mexican culture. That's yeah. amazing. Well, I oh, it's amazing. Well, then I'm shutting down your performance in the Hangover movies. Yeah, you're exactly. not that guy. You're, you're, I'm not, you're not, I'm not that Lebanese. Guy. I'm not Lebanese. No, I'm shutting down all performances. You were never that guy. That's what I mean. Chris, that's acting, dude. That's what I mean. Yeah, I think it, I'm liberal, though. See, yeah. yeah, but you get so like, oh, I'm if real, you're, I'm real that you don't even. I'm know. the real deal. Yeah, that's not what I was trying to say. I that's wasn't exactly like, what you're saying. Thank you. <laughs> oh, don't thank me, man. I was trying to say something about the way you. There's a lot of hey, fucker. I win. <laughs> um, <laughs> Chris is dead. Know. Tragic news out of Marina Del Rey this morning. <laughs> I win. He said, I win. I win. And then he fucking expired. And then he was so fucking real about it that the doctors came in, did an autopsy, and said, natural causes. <laughs> He's in perfect health. He fucking keeps it he so just, real. You know he just said, I win, and he I fucking look passed at away. 31, I'm 31. I'm 31. Chris, remember the time we were talking about the song to play at Brian's funeral? Where? <laughs> Do you remember the name of that song? No. It was like some like fucking yeah, trap. Boom. Oh. Oh yeah, yeah. What the fuck was that let me, song? Let me see what if I can find it? it here. Oh fuck! Yep. I think I got it. What was it? I think I remember. This fuck guy's man. number one. He was our biggest influence. Yeah. <laughs> no, no, we used to talk about something. He was our biggest but... influence. 
<laughs> it was our biggest influence that we ever knew. We're crying, crying hard. We're crying at people. The tears are flying from my eyes. Not even, they're not even rolling down my cheeks. They're flying from my eyes. <laughs> Who would do Jesus that song? Christ. You guys we cry. Commission, you, we'd commission uh, you guys would cry so Guns and Roses uh, yeah. to come back and do the, your funeral song? The, you guys would cry so hard. The, 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 the first time this. tears shot out of someone's eyes. The, the tears are flying from my eyes and not my tears, my cheeks oh, yes. are dry, but I'm crying hard. Why? 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 Cause I'm crying so hard, I'm crying tears are flying from my eyes, flying from my eyes. Dude. A number one hit. If I Rest outli- please, if Brian I out- Allen, yeah, if I outlive you, I want to take this piece of podcasting set it to music yeah wow, wow. rest in peace brian there's another, another single here the, well, the you're doing good from my you're 51 eyes. years old crushing it. and like i've said before on on song. many mediums well whatever it's not that no, 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 do you to. know you want to find it well I here's what i was going to say about, i have it i have it i, I, I was going to say about brian at 51 yeah. yeah could beat the living shit out of cm punk 10 years younger thanks brother. you can no this guy brian you, you could beat cm punk he could beat the fucking tar out of him, I think. Really? Yeah, I want to see that. All right. In the UFC. One last fight. One last. Hey, he had, what was his name? Mike Jackson? Yeah. That's the only reason I remember it. I'll beat, I'll beat Chris's ass, I'll tell you that much. Couldn't. Why don't you dress up like CM Couldn't. Punk, Chris? I, a lot of people say I look like CM Punk. Yeah, let's you cut do. your hair. No, because then his career will be over. No, but, right. um, uh, you could, yeah, I, I uh, watched that fight going, okay, so they just kind of throw in, he's an entertainer. Yeah. Right, he's a professional wrestler. He's yeah. been training for a couple of years to do something, you know, that's other. Let's call yep. it other. Yep. Uh, you're primarily you're 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 an actor. You're yeah. a, a comedian. You're, a, you know, whatever the fuck. Right? Tennis player, boxer, uh-huh. wrestler. Uh, uh, and so uh, don't say tennis player. <laughs> don't say tennis. Player. But I I come off the ground when I hit. I mean, the, the top's been so stupid. Oh. <laughs> this is my funeral song. Yep. This was it. <laughs> Is that it, though? That's <laughs> so stupid. <laughs> yeah, God, will you kill it on this song, huh? Thank you. Wow. And they start tutting. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. That's my that's my funeral that's song. That's your funeral song. And Chris and I will come in. Are you guys carrying my my coffin? We're gonna be just like my floating body. next to your coffin like this. Am I not and in carrying a coffin? it? We're the only pall bearers. No, I want to be wrapped like a mummy, and you guys are carrying me wrapped like a mummy. Yeah. <laughs> in white and white. But we're just making you float. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, I'm, on your, I'm on your I'm on your shoulder. Crying. I'm on yeah. your shoulder. My body's rigor mortis. Your, your wife's crying. <laughs> and you your wink kids at her. Are mine. Oh, no. Yeah. No. And then we do that you thing. You walk by and wink at my wife with my with me on your shoulder, yeah. wrapped in gauze. You know, uh, you know, out here in L.A. and Southern California, they have those <clears throat> sign flippers. They have them in other parts of the country yeah. where it's like mm-hmm. Subway sandwich five ninety nine. Yeah, come Brian check out these that. new apartments. That's what we do with Brian's corpse mm-hmm. at the fucking funeral, and we just flip Good it around idea. and spin in it in the air. Chicken suits, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> in chicken suits to that song. Yep. yep. Oh, oh that'd be a cool funeral, Brian. Right, what money. do you serve for food? Money. What do you serve? Bacon. Uh, two no. white women are going to make burritos. Bacon. There you go. There you go. There you go. Two white women who went to Mexico are super foodies. Hey, you know what? Let's start a restaurant. Desire People fucking burritos. loved it. Yeah. And now it, the old. Boys. <laughs> Just while flipping Brian's body with chicken suits on. While white women make burritos. Yeah. <laughs> Wife crying so hard. Yeah. And, I'm, and your kids are on my shoulders. Why are they doing this? I don't <laughs> and then I bust out of the gauze and I'm like, psych. And yeah. I cut both your throats. Okay. And I drink your blood. Um, no. Okay. Too much. Um, yeah, no, um, hello, um. <laughs> oh, man. Um, uh, I'm tired today. All right, dude. Ooh. Flew around yesterday. I'm tired today. Uh, 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 all right. Flew on an airplane. They kept delaying it. Was that in New, <laughs> New York? They had that Nor'easter, I guess, right? Ah, I hate the Nor'easter. Dude, uh, I, yeah, like yeah. it's just not done. Don't say that, right? Um, I mean, this this podcast could just be a day. What? A day long. Oh, yeah. Yeah, just let's hang. keep going. Yeah, are there any more current events? Um, I don't want to bring any sad stuff. So. Yeah, bring it up. Whatever. I love sad stuff. 
Well, how about Starbucks closing 150 stores next year? Why? Yeah, because well, usually they down. just close 50. Why? Because they just they, you, no, they usually just close 50 stores a year, right. but it's three times. Yeah. Too many. Uh, yeah, they they're just know. not doing well. Those locations, well, there's also stores that so do well. Much. I know it's crazy. Like how much coffee can you? There's, drink? I, I, you know what, dude? I, I, I swear to God, I woke up the other day. I didn't realize this. there's a there's a Starbucks in my guest room. There's a Starbucks. How did in you my not know? Room. Wait a minute. How did you not know? Go that? in. Uh, dude, no, wait a minute. In. So they started like someone paid dude, the franchise fee and had. You know what? I guess so. This was yesterday. I'm still there's figuring it out. There's employees and shit. There's three employees. Three people are working yeah, it's in there. Fucking crazy. How, other three. customers. Yeah, there have been people coming. So is that because you don't go around? Or do you have a? Is your house? Is it? A, it's obviously very big. I mean, what? hey, I'm doing well. How Come many on, rooms? Chris, let's... How many rooms in here? Yeah. How? You know what? I don't know. Oh, <laughs> okay, so fuck's sake. okay, so that's a manor. Is that a manor or is it a mansion? Don't look like you don't know the answer to that. Yeah, please. you're being. You're being. How about this? What? Yeah. You don't. I'll let you know. Oh, come on. You're, first of all, you're never going to get back to us with that. No. Second of all, you fucking don't mean it. Oh, look at your hands. Yeah. Look at your fucking crooked mouth. That's not even a thing you do. Yeah, you're, that is so not a thing you do, you I, motherfucker. Like my thing. I do this a lot. No, no you, you don't do that. He's falsely modest right now. He's making a what face. Cut what the fuck? Do you, do you have what? a name for your house? Is it a, or is it just an address? It's probably I just mean, a house. You don't It's have. got a, what? Well, it's got like a CD on the gate. Okay, what? What? Don't, don't look at your eyes don't again. Do that. What is it? Dude, say? you're so expressive when you're lying. CD on the gate. No, you Chris don't have that. Crystal. <laughs> oh, fuck. You got to be careful. You're going to flatline again. You're going to die if you yeah. get. No, dude, I'm fine, dude. Right now, because I feel really good. Okay. Does your place have. How are you doing? Oh, shit. <laughs> hey, man, does your. <laughs> <laughs> Natural causes. <laughs> <laughs> he hey. lived too hard, he lived too much. You Do you won. have that that blonde draft uh, coffee? That new Starbucks? They have that. Yeah, it's actually one of those uh, Starbucks. What I don't know what they call them, but I was trying to ask the employee, but I was so tired, I was going to bed. Um, and because uh, it's a twenty four, I guess it's twenty four. Do they work yeah. for you? Ted, that's a fucking major Starbucks. That stays some, up. I know. I should be making some sort of m money, right? Yeah. Do they? You know what? They might close, but I don't know. Do you Does have your employees? Starbucks have the new like uh, the new <clears throat> chicken tortilla egg sous vide? Deal? Oh, that yeah. Not just the other two. Yeah, there's but the I bacon thought, and Gruyere, yeah, but and then there's yes, the egg they white. Have, they, well, they say they have them, but they're always out. Oh mm. fuck, they're always they're popular, out of those. They're popular, right? Dude, he yeah. really has a Starbucks mm. in that's, his house. That's impressive. It's cool too because if I don't have a um, if, if I don't have a phone charger, they have those fucking table chargers. Yeah, I can just go on and just place my phone on there. And so, you, but yeah. you had to know that when you went in there, you're like, put a Starbucks here, and then this. Now, do you no, allow anybody no. into the Starbucks, or is there a? They they. Yeah, I mean, yeah, you can let anybody in. Mostly, I would say it's it's mostly white people. And then, okay, dude, that's, wow, man, I, I, well, I have why, nothing to do with it. Well, why is it so just? Weird. Why is it? No, why I have nothing to do with it. It's not just white people. It's just mostly Fuck. white. And who else? That's a bound in. Okay, Jeez, see, man. he said yeah. mostly. Yeah. So that's a weird like thing a, we got going. Is it a, is that, no, I'm trying. I'm not trying uh, to. I'm not trying to. Is it? Are you saying that you have a? I'm, I'm not a yeah. white only Starbucks in your home. <laughs> it, uh, I don't care. I'm not judging you. No, I, I know. And, and and again, it has nothing to do with me. It's well, <laughs> but it is in your home. It's in your home, Chris. No, it's in I, your house. I, You've been saying that for yeah, the past I, five minutes. And I didn't. I didn't. I didn't have a. I didn't know. Dude. Yeah. Now we got to. We got to talk about. You're talking about a guy who's got a. I mean, I've got a big house. Right? I know, don't curl I know, your lip. Every time he talks about the size of his house, he's got curl in his I mouth. Know. But and you have a racist coffee. No, shop. no, 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 no. Well, I don't have any but, but, coffee shop. Okay, shops. but you do admit that they, that they. There is a Starbucks in my home. That's a coffee that's shop. A, is, I found out about that yesterday. About what? That there, that it's is it is that white people only are there by coincidence or is there a barrier to entry to people who have more melanin in their skin so i popped in about five or six oh, times yesterday because i i still every time i was like wait a minute really and i would walk in and i'd be like this is your home yeah okay but, my home yeah and every time i walk in maybe six seven eight nine times it's a lot yeah there were it was pretty much white people okay oh, and he has a white owned only that okay white, so it, is there a sign 
or anything. So it's Starbucks. Says, so they do have signs. Yeah, yes, they have no, a bunch of signs. They have, they, but they have that sign that says Starbucks, and then they have a sign that says um, things on this premises may cause cancer and birth defects or whatever that yeah, fucking yeah, sign yeah. is. Okay, yeah, they have yeah. to have that. Uh, they have to have that one. Yeah. Yeah. And then uh, oh, we can re- right. We have the right to refuse service to anyone. That's and then a bunch of yeah, you know, that's not. And then like what that. else? So is there anything? Is there anything? There was there was small wording under that. Which one? Do you remember uh, what that said? Uh, under the, we, res- we reserve a right to refuse service to anyone. And then a bunch of stuff under that that was in parentheses. Did it say of color? No, I, it said something like, because when I got closer to the sign, yeah, because no, it was no, small, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. But they were it like, could. it said n- no Black. Oh okay. boy, Chris. <laughs> Chris, that's a Chris, super. It, you have a Asian, you have a white only Asians. And Dude. And, Asians. Or, and then it said or other. So what? what? That is. That's but, everyone. Yeah. That's, dude, that's everyone. That's everyone. I'm a, I'm a, you can't have this. You have to change that sign. That's a. That's a. That's a. That's a. That's an, that's an but extreme. But again, I have nothing to do with this. But you have an extremist. You, you, you have an do. extremist Hold on. white yes, nationalist. Yes, you do. It's in your house. It, I had yeah. no You're going to be responsible for it no matter you what. Can't have a, I don't I give a shit know. who you bring this if to. I Any court in the no, land. You can't have a white And I mean the land. We'll yeah. say, you had it in your house, sir. Right. Right here. Right. And All I the go, evidence. And then There's I go a like room this. in your house where. Excuse me, Judge. I didn't know that. No, no. Hold on, Your Honor. But you do now. And here's the thing. You've known for a day. Judge guy. Chris, you've known for a day that you have a. White's only room in your house. It's not a room. It's a Starbucks. And it's, I, it is a Starbucks. But what, it's, it's a room that serves I think, honestly, Starbucks would be in a lot of trouble. Chin Let's call it a offended. Starbucks. It doesn't matter if, if it's a room or a okay, Starbucks. I have a question. Okay. Hold Let them call but it. They have those it's a Starbucks. Fine, fine. Just walk in. We put know your phone on. about if, that. If Chin walks in mm-hmm. with a friend of his who happens to also be Asian or, right. let's say, of Latin descent or, or of well, African-American descent, yeah. what, can, what happens when he tries to get Well, let's put it this way. I'll stop right there. Chin doesn't walk in. <laughs> yeah. And, and they, cause the, they have a... Oh, man. That's oh so fucked God. up. Chris, what do they have? Well, they have a... Um, they have a... I don't want... I mean... I, I, I Again, yesterday, I walk in. I'm noticing all this shit. I'm looking at, and they actually have a separate entrance. And oh, I was like, no. in my house? I had no idea. I know, but Chris, what happens? What so I have? walk out, and I'm like... There's... Nobody stopped you when you walked in? No, I know nobody, it's your house, but nobody, nobody stopped me. No. You're, well, you look Albanian, which is technically white. <laughs> so there you have it. So, yeah. so I walked into the part. You know, you know the. You know when you walk into a bank and yeah. they have the first entrance, yeah. and then you have to wait for them to have the light turn green till we open up the second entrance. Yeah. Okay. So, sort of. So what happens is no. when when a bank gets robbed, oh. if a bank gets robbed, there's two en- entrances, yeah. right? And they're one after another. And the robber leaves the one door, and then they trap them in the oh, little area yeah. to where they can't leave the second door, right? right. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. This Starbucks has a version of that, uh, right? So Chris, what? It, and you can only make it. No, I'm saying it you, has a. It has Jin, a, no problem getting past the first entrance, it right? Has right. So, but then he has to get. He goes into the. He's in the, the detention, chamber, right? So, and then the what sec- happens? It's a detention, to Jin? So now it's a detention sec- center. No, 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 no. So now the second entrance that would be a red light for for Chin would see a red light. <laughs> so right? he's Chris. This is when does he get his coffee? Racist. How does he get his coffee? Well, he, there's. I mean. He's free to go anywhere else if he wants. No, Chris, you have a racist no, coffee shop. I don't know you have it's in your house. You've known about it. It's in your house. You have no idea. Day. You it's have in your house. You guys, I don't, listen, I don't understand why you guys are upset. You guys I, want to get coffee. You just come right in. Because I'm not a racist. <laughs> yeah, but that's not the point. This I don't even a, want, I don't want to have anything to do with that. I'm not, going, I'm not going there. I'm not going there for coffee. Either. No, you, you got Starbucks right there and you brought them this thing. There's no way you paid for this. That's from the whites only Starbucks. That's a racist coffee. Chris. And you didn't even pay for this thing. No. Chris. Right. I don't want that. You go my... there every day. You, you drank a little bit of it. I'm so what? So don't we're all you kind of in this together, right? What's the name of that? What's the name of that? That? What's the name of that drink? So right it there? has two names, right? Yeah. So it has it's called the Simply Strawberry. Okay. Mm-hmm. And then and then so they said so and and then and then under it it says made by made with re- real strawberry, sugar, mm-hmm. fructose, whatever. Sorry, it's a little red. We wish that it was. White. <laughs> oh, 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 man. Pure white. Pure white. Chris, Chris, you have to. This, that is an aggressively racist you Starbucks in your house, You're man. Insanely Yo, these racist. people hate everyone but whites. <laughs> 
Chris. <laughs> Dude, this is fucked up, Chris. This is not going to look good. It's not no. for me. I swear. And you oh. keep saying that, but don't imagine you understand? Imagine you wake up one day. <laughs> no, you walk I, into I, a room. Just let him. Yeah. yeah. Imagine you wake up one day. You walk into a room. Yeah. And you're how, you haven't been down that corridor or whatever it's, the fuck, right? Sometimes that happens. And you open up the door. Well, and no, that doesn't sudden, happen. You, <laughs> you try to give you the benefit of the doubt. Yeah, but a <laughs> corridor you, that you haven't been you down. see all of a sudden a bunch of green and it's a Starbucks. And you're like, holy shit, I had nothing to do with this. Okay. Uh, That's where I'm coming from. Right. And it happens to be, I apparently, I'm realizing now, a white's only. Now Starbucks. you're realizing that? Chris, you've known for a, a full day and you still haven't taken action. Have you talked to anybody about this? I feel like this? in some ways you. So I asked the guy who works there, right? And I was like, what's, what's the deal? What's his name? So his name? Yeah. Uh, his name is, uh, <clears throat> his, his name is uh, Henry. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. It's a regular name. Okay. Right? Yeah. Uh and so so I asked him how did they, what's the deal with this, right? And he goes like this. I don't have anything to do with this. <laughs> Nobody's responsible. Nobody's for this? responsible for this insanely racist coffee shop. <laughs> Henry's a white guy. Uh, who instituted? Who did the? Who put the sign? I up? mean, not that it matters, but I think Henry might have something to do I with would this. Imagine. He's, yeah, he's a white guy. Okay, but then you. Okay. But you're also going. I got nothing. To do. Right. Everybody's like. Is there anybody there that took responsibility for their insanely racist? You said there were three people policies? working there. Yeah, three other guys. Two other. Who guys. are the two other, other guys? guys? Yeah, Henry. Zach, that's a Zach white Henry, dude. Yeah, that's a and white guy. I'm not even going to ask. Yeah, well, Henry, Hamilton? Zach, C Cody, Cody, Cody. Yeah. Those guys are white. Those are white. Dudes. Well, Cody's young. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. So is Henry, Henry too, because he probably has those parents who are like, yeah, let's yeah, call him exactly. Let's call him Jack yeah, or Henry. One of those is, is throwback there, names. Yeah. Right? Call about, him a throwback name, yeah. Brian. Which? Watch this. Well, call him a throwback name. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's my transatlantic guy. That's good. Sorry, it's good. It's, good. it's also really good. No, so, good. And, uh, so, so, and then Cody and Zach. And, yes, and Zach and Zach is an older man. Okay, right? now, now and he, he doesn't. Be... He doesn't wear the uh, the green, the apron, or whatever. The fuck. Okay, so, so he's is, the man. What does he wear? He's, yeah, sure. He's the manager. What's, what's exactly. he wearing? So he's got all sorts of other shit going on. He. <laughs> He might be the one responsible. No, I don't, I don't. You know what? I'm not sure because he's not even wearing the Starbucks outfit. What is he that's wearing? What I'm, that's what we're saying. So he has like this white. Ugh. What? <laughs> go on. Oh, no. Fucking go on. White top. Is it a white? Just a white is top? It a white like smock a, looking just got, thing? Exactly, yeah. Is it so, a, yeah. is it's it a, a smock? Is it, whoa, 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 is, it, is it to keep off the, like coffee maybe, off his maybe actual there shirt? Was hold on, hold on. Some is it a red and black? No, oh. I think, ah! wait. Is it a ro oh boy? Is it, hold on. Is it a robe? Yeah, I mean, maybe he just rolled okay. out of bed or... He's a, wiz he's a grand wizard. Yeah, he he's got no red magic. and black. He knows no, no, magic. no, no, no. He, I, I, he knows does no he magic. Have like it sort of, does taste magical. Does he have little symbols uh, like on his oh, so person you know that, that sort of look like the, the thing that would ne be next to like, oh, you're in this is the auto club. And then there's like an emblem you've That's never seen. That's the red seen. and black shit. Or like those, yeah, those symbols. Like dude, when you get like emoji symbols, you're like, what's this swirly So The fucking clan secretly open the Starbucks in your goddamn house. <laughs> you, have to, you have to get them the fuck out of there, dude. Chris, you gotta the get clan the clan out of your fucking house. has opened the Starbucks and they're profiting and you have the clan in your house. You have You're to get... You're probably profiting I somehow. I, I, I know I, an exterminator. So I, they're leasing guy, from you whether you know it or guys, not. I don't he can gas them out of there. But I was like, guys, I was like, what, gas them out? Yes, there's so a put guy... put them in the No, there's way? a guy who can... He shoots a gas. It's not going to kill him, but it'll. it's a noxious gas that will get... It's they a, have that it's in a, the entryway. It's an anti-racist. In, in between the two entrances, it's an anti-racist no, no, gas. The they thing. have the gas. You got to get the guy in there. He'll he'll oh. fumigate. And the let place. me tell you too. I was like, "What? This is illegal!" And they go like this, dude. Here, don't worry about it. And I'm like, "Okay, it's just weird." You open a Starbucks, and I got. So I drove it here. They gave me a Ferrari. They gave you a Ferrari? They have money. They're probably making that much money there. You got rich clan members. Do you have like a lot of like? Probably a lot of just like white girls going in there because they all love Starbucks. Do they? Yeah, they're those? making so much money that they're giving them a fucking Ferrari on the side and telling them to keep quiet. Yeah. So I haven't said anything up until now. Are the girls though? Do the girls are they? Are, do they look like they've been indoctrinated? Is there is there any knitting and is there baking going on? Do they look like? Do they they're, keep their heads down? Yeah. yeah. They're, they're yeah. All, you know, have you ever those? seen the show? Um, Handmaids. Too. Yeah, that's yeah. exactly what it's okay. like. Okay, well, dude, yeah. see, those so they're wearing are, bonnets and those, shit. Those are clan they girls don't. who are who are have low self esteem and they don't yeah. talk back. And they're, they're probably all pretty being, young. I don't know if I've heard being, them say anything. To be are honest. they all pregnant? Dude, 
the, uh, three, there's been three pregnant ones. Okay, then can I say this, Chris? Have you made any of the girls pregnant? Chris, say no. It's Chris. Yeah. Please Listen, I'm no. asking you honestly, but please say no. No. You're fucking you're what? lying. You're, well, did you make any of these girls in, pregnant? Did you have sex with racist? Did you have sex girls? with the racist? Are you making racist babies, dude? God, dude, oh, no. you've known for way longer than a day. It takes nine months, months, a few months, hasn't it? Uh, geez, dude, you have a fucking months. Yeah, you have, <laughs> no, dude, you have a clan operated a, Starbucks in your Ferrari. house. He bought that Ferrari months. off the profits he made off his. What a fucking his weird Starbucks fucking thing this guy's doing. <laughs> He's got a fucking racist Starbucks. I'm so disappointed. He's impregnating young, quiet girls in bonnets. <laughs> Oh, dude, so I don't know, man. You're our friend and shit, but like, really? like you got to fuck it. You, you got to. They're against condoms. You gotta, ah, of course they are. You got to make this it right. It feels better without. So they're like, we're making up our own rules. Yeah. You got to make this right, Jack. Dude, you got to. Yeah. Please make it right, dude. I will. Your character is I weak. I promise dude. you, Your I will. Your character is weak. I'm going to make it right today. What are you going to do? What are you going to do? do when you I get home? I swear to God. What? I'm going to go- march right down there yeah. and I'm going to go home and I'm going to fucking, and I'm going to, I'm going to, after I get a coffee, I'm right. going to fucking, oh, uh, fuck's sake. I'm going to say, gonna uh, he's going to get a coffee. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to open up a rival fucking coffee. Oh, bean. That's, that's not, you're going to make it worse. My house, on the gonna, other side of my house you, for blacks. No. How about that? No, I mean, oh, for well, only blacks. Well, not only, you can't it's actually only, not a bad no, idea. Because then Asians, it has to be colorblind. That, that's the whole point of this country. Yeah, I know. He's right. You got to have everybody in there and then. And you have to, you're not going to drive them out of business. You have to just. I'll drive them out of business no, you have with a black st- coffee bean. No, you have to shut them Maybe he them just down. drives them out of business first with the black coffee bean, then the black coffee no, bean says psychic no, for everybody. No, you have to oh, just say this idea. is illegal and you have to just shut but them down. But he's trying to figure out a way to fucking deal with no, it, Brian. Get, you, at exactly. this point, he can't just go, oh, sorry, oops, 14 months. No. He has to proactively exactly. get after it and start a black exactly. Starbucks. Listen, listen to me. Listen to me. Listen to me. I know how to solve this problem. Relax. All right, what is it? I'll get some of my, my, my thug friends. They're white. And they got... So they'll they're trust fi- them when they fi- go in they're, there? They're fighters. Yeah. Oh, and, of course and they they're, are. They're, and we'll go in there. I'm going to come with them. And we're going to have pieces of hickory. Okay? And we're going to wear <laughs> Just them... Just random our, pieces of hickory? We're going to wear them in our pants. And then okay. we're going to come in. And, and you have one of those... In now, the how door, are we going to get... The door. Pa- if they know you're threatening, how are they going to no, get past the second No, we're not. We're going to come in as whites. And we're going to go, hey, whites. And we're going to... Uh, uh, yeah. And they're going to be like, hey, guys, what can I get you? And then I'm going to have a <laughs> fucking... You got one of those doors. You have one of those doors, those big industrial doors, because it's the Starbucks. Yes. Right? I'm gonna, yes, I'm gonna come in. I'm gonna come in two. with one of those big padlocks that you see on ships with the chains. Yeah, and I'm gonna. And oh, one those, of those are big. Giant on industrial like wow. padlocks that you'd use <laughs> really to, to keep to keep gold in a large chest. Okay. Yeah. And I'm gonna go. I'm gonna pull. I'm gonna pull up the chain. I'm gonna lock the door. And I'm gonna go there. Now you can't leave. That's from Bronx Tale. Now go on. Now you can't leave. That's the most famous line from uh-huh. the movie now that a lot of people Now you can't leave. Shut yeah. the fuck up. Sorry. On. Sorry. That's fine. You can You be in the corner crying like the fucking cowardly. Don't bring me with cowardly you. Cowardly race, race apologist, <laughs> racist apologist nope. you are. And I'll me have and one my, of these me and strawberry my, Me and my friends are going to pull out our hickory and, and have a good old time on some racist noggins. Yeah. And that's how we're going to close your fucking Starbucks down. And you, there it was. I never saw Sonny so mad. Yep. He beat up all those guys at and Starbucks. they all at Starbucks and they all w- regretted the day they crossed him yep. when he locked the door and said that. And close and clo- close up on that close up on my face as I'm done uh, as I'm done making mincemeat literally of all their all the all everybody in the Starbucks with my hickory and I just come up and there's blood that just it just drips. Mm. It from, just drips. from your nose. Yep. And you've been just, doing just, coke the whole time watching. Yep. <laughs> Yeah. And I just, I just, and that music from my funeral is playing. And then I kill myself. What? Yeah, I kill wow. myself. Wow, weird, weird. I know. With, hey, my, with my own hickory. Well, yeah. With my guys. Own hey, so that was the longest bit we've ever done. <laughs> that was yeah. a long bit. Yeah, yeah. That was it was a, a pretty good long bit. bit. Twenty-five minutes. It was a good bit. Racist it. Starbucks. It got in my racist house. in there. Right. Racist Starbucks in my yeah, house. Yeah, it was really good. You well, brought guys, it back to the to the song. I'm glad you guys drove down here for this. Hey, I'm sorry. You know, I just wanted to come by and say, hey, Chris. But we. You have anything else you want to say, Will? Oh shit! I'll be in. Uh, where are we going? Portland. Yeah, we'll be in Portland be in this Portland, weekend. Maine, and then I, I got Portland, then, Maine, or Portland, Oregon. Yep, and then I got uh, I got Tampa. 
Yeah. Uh, and then I got and then I got yeah, yeah, Syracuse. Yeah, 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 go to yeah, yeah. T5K for tickets. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey. Or go to ChrisLea.com and come to where the fuck I am. It's uh, all good. Uh, Chris, Chris going to open for me. Maybe Will will too. I'm, I'm heading up north to shoot the second season of Louder Milk. So watch the first season right now. Nobody right? does. But here's the and thing. And you're on school days. I'm on school. School time. Say school. No, it's school. Schooly. It's called Schooly D. You guys are being dicks. It's called school. No. Yeah. I started shooting the end of August. Cool. Very busy. You got my so special. Shooting, 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 shooting my special. Episodes, you guys right? know it's sold out, Talia Hall, but the 19th, still some tickets left. You shoot Thursday two, warm up episodes, show. Right? Yeah. Me and Shab. What? I can't shooting, wait. Shooting two, three episodes of that school show. I'm shooting 13. Don't be mm-hmm. disrespectful. That's what you're supposed to Get rid of the pink. Cover. Yeah, why is your cell phone? Tulsa, Oklahoma, Midwest City, Oklahoma, Dallas, Portland, Maine, These Hampton are all Beach, places. Mashantucket, <laughs> yep. Houston, Texas, Montreal, Wichita. You know what I mean? I, I'm going. Just go to crystalia.com. Hey, uh, are you performing anywhere live soon? Well, yeah. Well, yes. Like, where can I see you? <laughs> Just go to crystalia.com. Dude. Okay, hey, calm down, but, man. I'm a fan. All right? Calm down, motherfucker. I'm a fan. You, all right? You're not a fan. Well, guys, Don't be easy. yelling at me because I just want to come see your car. Right, oh, guys, dude. take it easy. Where man. are you going to be soon? I, I just mentioned yeah. where I was going to okay, be. Okay, when's soon. the next time you're doing comedy? I, I just said Oklahoma, dude. When? Thursday. Okay, take what? it easy. Dude, dude I'm a fan, I, man. <laughs> Guys, take it easy, man. Um, oh, fuck. Guys, let me ask you this. By the way, uh, Syracuse is July 13th and 14th. Oh, Gotham added a, uh, a show in Gotham July 12th, Thursday, New York City, July 12th, Gotham Comedy And if you're Club, a fan of mine I'm in New there. York City, don't go. No, don't. No. <laughs> Chris, you can't If you like Chris, like if you that. like Chris, add just ramp up the funny, and that's Brian Callen. So that's what it is. <laughs> ramp it the fuck up about 17 notches. Gotham Comedy Club, July 12th. 13th and 14th, Syracuse, Funny Bone. Is this the, the longest podcast you've that. ever done? <laughs> no. I'm gonna be what cra- is? I'm going to be cracking wise with some friends. No, I'm going to be hanging dude. out. If you're around, if you're one of my close friends, and we have we share a laugh together, I uh, hope you enjoyed it. Jesus Christ, Why don't you stand dude. on a bucket? Why don't you stand on a bucket <laughs> outside of a, a Whole Foods you know and I'd, tell my jokes you know and I'd, say an experience, experience with, a bro, with Brian Callen, just do impressions. You know me. that I would crush a bucket, you fucking asshole. Yeah. I know you said that. Hey, how about yeah, I did. Will, nice shoes, Brian. The fuck? <laughs> Come on, these are fucking my Pegasus Nikes. These yeah, are, uh, dude, where'd you get those? Hey, hey, guys. Hey, guys, my wife just sent me uh, a reminder that she and my kids are going to be at the Getty Villa um, this this afternoon. And, performing? And are they performing? No, they're going to go, I guess, the Getty Museum to see uh, some museum exhibit. I can't go. Why not? Is it because you're busy or is it because... Your brain doesn't allow you to want to. That's my brain doesn't allow me to want to. Have you ever been to a fucking museum and enjoyed it? Ever? Eh. I mean, do I have my phone with me? <laughs> I like museums, to be honest. Yeah. Even though that, yeah, I really do. Like museums what? are. F- you I, like museums? I do. Yeah. What the? fuck? I know it's weird. Chris Chris likes you know what else I like? Shit. You know what, what else I like? I love musicals. You do? Are you love serious? Them. Fucking love them. Dude. I would never think. I that. know. I'm a surprise, dude. What uh, <laughs> did you? <have> you seen- <laughs> Really? I can't imagine turning around and shock you. What music? What musicals have you loved? Uh, Wicked. Um, wow. The producers is fucking hilarious. Wow. Uh, dude, I've gone by myself to see musicals. Really? Wow. Yep. I never would have guessed. When you're in New York, you'll go see a musical. I have. I have. That's yeah, amazing. Jekyll and Hyde. I saw it by myself. Oh my god. When I was out. Um, That's amazing. I, yeah, I've seen so many. I mean, I've seen, I love them. And what about you? I just saw the play that goes wrong. In uh, I love going in to New theater. York. I rarely. Oh, and I also while I was there, I saw. Um, in and of itself, which is a very interesting illusionist uh-huh. thing. Playing till August, everybody. Listeners okay. of Fighter of the Kid uh, have access to New York. I highly recommend it. In and of itself. Yeah. You don't have listeners uh, in New York, though, right? You only have no. like, Dude, like the Southern listeners dude, that are I'll like, sell out. Hey, boy, you listen to that podcast? No, no don't. <laughs> Fritz, that's not. My goodness. Don't do that. Hey, boy, you listen to that TFATK? That, <laughs> those are the guys listen, that are. That's your impression of my average yeah. man? You listen to that shit with the broken sign? <laughs> you fucking listen to TFATK? <laughs> He You're, got a Starbucks in his own house, what, we, which I would like to visit. We got to sound like we no. need to go. Yeah. Oh, Pronto. Our, our, you can get any of those Starbucks drinks that you could have over here at the mall, only the difference is there's no blacks. <laughs> no. <laughs> and also, wait, they wait, seem no to what? know how to treat no. women. Wait, yeah. No what? There's no blacks, and the women, what, which never speak to the men who make all the rules there. It's starting to sound like Bill Cosby. No 
Starbucks. Richard, we got an all white Starbucks that I started in Crystalia's house. So I could train white women not to Come talk. To think of it, Zach, I've never seen his face. He has the, you know what I mean? It like could a, be Bill Cosby. Be. What a fucking awesome ripple at the that end of good. that bit. That yep. And it's Bill Cosby. Dude, I'm ripple. fucking buff, huh? <laughs> Right? Just a fucking, fucking asshole. Buff. I'm. Th- you know what I am? What? Dumb buff. No, nah, you Dumb dude, buff. Are you are diesel? Like, no, nah, but I'm fucking diesel. But <laughs> you know what's weird is I'm fucking diesel. But, dude, I fucking. Uh, people, I swear to God, my name is. It, it, that's not really him, is it? I oh, think that's my name. God. Because that's what they were calling me. How many pairs of shoes do you own, you fucking. 150, zero? maybe. That's so bad. That's a lot. Why do you wear those? Why I like you, those. I like the Air thanks. Max. You just like gold, uh, bad sneakers, huh? With those big soles. Hey, dude. What? You're going to watch your fucking mouth. <laughs> Guys, don't you are gonna, you, you, hey. you are. What? Hey, not. <laughs> What's the longest podcast you've ever done for real? We could do it, chill. Okay. B- b- okay, I'm sorry, you're right. I, I'll flip off the handle. Yeah, but tell Guys, him if he's going to step to me, I'll I, fucking Yeah, but I've way. seen you guys get violent. And I'll meet I him know, but I flew off the handle. I'm sorry. Yeah, but I'll meet Just him Just don't. I'm going to go through fit. a lot. I have a fucking racist Starbucks in my house. Yeah. Don't get physical. Which you've enabled, so fuck And I have a Ferrari. Don't. But And you think I want that Ferrari? Yeah, you know what? You don't, just don't. Don't ever come at me like that because I will meet you halfway and more. Guys, guys, please, but, but you know, let's not get out he of control. Needs to know. He's never had his ass kicked. And yeah, but will. you're fucking, you're I'm going dude. on now. And I'm undefeated. You know what that means? I'm undefeated. Guys, don't I've never had my ass kicked. Why? Because I'm undefeated. No, because you never fought a guy that's, who can that's fucking what, pepper your face. Guys, don't fight. All right? Please don't fight. I pepper your face. One time please when I was a fight. kid, I fucking was at this Mexican restaurant and my friend Morgan Doizaki was there. Oh, yeah, I know Morgan. Fa- you fa- don't know Morgan, but fa- anyway, he's what a fucking cool guy. He's Japanese. Japanese. He's Japanese. Guy. Japanese, Japanese guy. Yep. Yeah. Okay. Well, don't act like you're cool because you know the last name Doizaki is Doizaki. Japanese. Okay? But I will tell you this thing, um, that I put salt in my hand and I said, hey, Morgan, you want to feel my ninja dust? And he said, well, what the fuck is that? And I said, do you want to feel my ninja dust? He said, well, what the fuck is it? I said, well, I'm not going to tell you. I have to show you. And he said, okay. And I threw it in his eyes. And he goes, wow. like, oh, what the fuck did you just do? Oh, what the fuck are you doing? Oh, what the fuck are you doing? And that's how he talks. Yeah, he talks really fast. super. That's very stereotypical. Why no, 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 have... I wasn't a Japanese. He was, what the fuck are you doing? He would just talk like really fast. Like, what, 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 what the fuck are you doing? What are you doing? Well, no, what? that's British. Uh, what the fuck are you doing, mate? Well, he, that's actually British. He wasn't uh, a British Japanese guy. But, so you oh, carry, I, thought, I thought you were top geezer. You fucking threw um, salt in my eyes, mate. No, 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 no. Because that's what I heard, too. Top geezer. Oh, what the fuck are you doing? Oh, what the fuck are you doing? That's how he was That's that's. Dangerously it's, close to sounding very stereotypically, like condescendingly well, no, Japanese. No, it's not. It's yeah, not condescending. That's what it was. He was one of my best friends. Doing? What the fuck are you doing? No, he wasn't like. Oh, who the fuck are you? He wasn't like that. He was like, oh, what the fuck are you doing? What the fuck are you doing? So he was like that. It wasn't so, a Japanese accent. He didn't. So even what have a would Japanese. be a Japanese guy if a Japanese guy had come here and only been speaking English for a little while and I threw salt in his eyes and be respectful? Yeah. So if I, he, I'm well, going to throw salt in your eyes, right. ready? That. Well, he'd take his sword out. He has. They <laughs> don't have swords. Japanese. We're talking. That's so con. Yeah, no. You don't all have swords. The, you know, that flap that they have. That <laughs> Yeah, the they don't wear those anymore. I know what you're talking about, but I still that. don't they think they do They don't wear those. Him. He'd kill you honorably. I mean, that's... Okay, what would he say? I mean, I don't, I don't know Japanese. Okay, he spoke English. This is the end. He would say, this is the end, or something very... How? It's very poetic. How? Yeah. How? Harry Carey. How would he say, this he is the end? He would make you do it. <laughs> he would say... This, this is the end. <laughs> I don't know. This is the end. This is the end. And then you, and then you would. This is the end. Go right through you, like like a like a like a like a sword. And do you well, know, honestly, do you know like, what I would like say? A, there? Do you know what I would say? Sword. So stab me. Wow! You, you learn Japanese from and the then guitar. I go, hey, Are you one? Ooh, right, but you know what? It would it would go through like a fucking like a knife through up water. Really, mm. it would just slice you up. Yeah, and then he'd 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 look at you. You know, he'd make sure to fucking huh. You know, and you'd you'd be like, that's yeah. what I do. You know, and blood would be, and it would hit his face a little bit, and you'd look, and he'd be looking. He'd make sure, huh, and it. You know, make sure you're looking at him, and then when you look at him, you'd look at him, and he'd have he'd have tears in his eyes because you both knew he had to do that, and oh. he, and you both understood the honor. Okay. Yeah. And then you die. And then you die. And then you die. Yeah. And when you fall, 
He pulls dick out and you mouth fuck. Oh, him. that's dude, exactly that's right. Because that is the that's honorable not way. Part of that's the the honorable way. way. And it doesn't even look you pretty. He honestly gets on top of you no. and yeah. his fucking bad ass is the thing you can see. <laughs> and he just fucking like fucks your mouth a little bit. Like, and not bit. even, he doesn't even do it like nice like that. No. Just, you know what he does? He goes like this, he goes like this, and he goes like this. He just. <laughs> Ew. He moves up barely down, into it, not yeah. into it. Ew. He and his, his leg, yeah. he moves his flap so Ew. his fucking dick can get and inside. And it's no it. waist action; it's all fucking it's, sore legs. It's, rough. Fuck it's this. friction. It's and then, friction. And then, yeah, you know, just what, let I, me you know what I most... say? You know what I do? What? You're dead. Seen <laughs> <Zin, Zin> better. Seen <laughs> <Zin, Zin> better. <laughs> yeah. Then I, and I die. That last insult, I get the last word in. I go slam. Yeah. Yeah. Right. yeah. Has anyone ever done this? Yeah, dude, I like that. Hey, man, you guys have been so disrespectful on my podcast. To everyone, really. I'm, yeah. Fuck yeah. I, I'm, 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 <laughs> yeah, you're a bitch. I don't do that Yeah, shit. you're a bitch, aren't you? Don't, yeah, you know what, man? I'm not. Hey, good podcast. What are uh, you, a bitch? Nice. Hey, Will, that water jug is too big. Of course it is. <laughs> no, it's not. It's so annoying. Will, no, at least you, you know what you can do? You can hold it with one hand and do that. But how about this? Then it's it, not, it, that's it, disrespectful, if somebody, dude. If somebody starts shooting at you, you can hide behind it at No, least. yeah, yeah. You know what, dude? Yeah. Just, how about this? Get one half the size, and yeah. when you're done with it, get another one. <laughs> no, I need this one. It's, it's got two compartments, and the other compartment holds an extra pair of shorts. <laughs> <laughs> For me, yeah. yeah. All right, dude. Okay, I'm done, man. you know? All Fuck right, listen, this guys, podcast. We're gonna go it's mine now. Fucking super deluxo kid and the sweet toot tootin' tart tart no, ass. No, that's not true. This has been a shithead. This has been. I don't bad. give a fuck. I don't give a fuck. Whoa. You know what I mean? Yeah. And it's always like the fight of the kid. Yeah. As if that's uh, the pinnacle of fucking. You got exactly. speaking of white guys. Yeah. You got like four or five of them and Bobby Lee uh, fighting for that fucking thing yeah, every that's year. Right. Yeah, yeah, who gives a oh, fuck? By the way, Outside of that, does oh, anybody give a shit? By the yeah. way. Just give it to him, then give it to me, then give it to Michael by Rappaport. The way. No, the then give it to fucking to Bobby Lee, Let me then tell back you something to right Theo now. Vaughn. Let me tell you something right now. I didn't promote that bullshit at all. I lost by 1%. If I promoted it, God does. Actually, also, let me tell you this much. If I, if I ever win that, I'm making you some fucking earrings. <laughs> I'm melting it down. And you're going to have some... Is right. Beautiful ears. <laughs> hey, you fuck. <laughs> you don't diss. Let's the, put some yes, ornaments yeah. on your fucking lobes. You don't disrespect. <laughs> that. That's an amazing award. You don't disrespect. Speaking anybody. of awards, what what happened with the award that I gave you, best woman from the last time I was here? I never got it asked. What did I tell you about that? If I fuck don't see you. it here next time, something's going up your ass. <laughs> well, Chris, I like. I'm I into bought that. him a fucking award at the fucking airport. They didn't have. It was an Oscar. <laughs> I, it, I saw that. Actually. Okay, it said best woman and he yeah. was offended by that yeah, I was. because he's a piece of shit there it is. and so <laughs> there it is. oh there it is okay there it is well then fuck we're fine you. yeah so so fuck okay. both you guys uh, this is our this has been the fighter and the kid core strength and what are you doing now what's this delivering it to you <laughs> Wow, that's good. Don't do it. Don't do it well. Nice. Don't that's how it should it. be. Don't do it well. Hold on. It'll figure it out. Don't do it. Well, it's gonna... don't. there you go. There you don't go. Shoot. Perfect. Yeah, Will. deliver it to him. Don't. That fucking Will. bitch. Deliver it. That little fucking. <laughs> yeah, you're welcome. <laughs> well, you're a machine to do thanks. it. Thanks. We won. We won. Thanks, guys. Thank I you, love guys. Love you guys, and I appreciate it. Preach. Preach, appreciate it. Appreciate you guys. I feel like it was Preach. a long episode of 10 Minute Podcast, but it was the fight of the is, kid. Man. No one knows that. And you guys, we're out. Okay. We're out. Preach.